Welcome back to Magic Titans, where we play fun and friendly games of magic of all sorts. We're super excited to be here on this debut of Ixalan, specifically playing the pre-constructed commander decks. My name is Adrian. I am joined by my amazing friends. We have Bridger, we have Shane, and we have Brandon. How's everyone doing today? Great. I'm so excited to be here. Oh, it's going to be awesome. I, I finally get to play these decks. I've been wanting to play <laughs> these decks for so long. We've had them for so long. Yeah. <laughs> we get to play Ah, super exciting. Uh, we'll, of course, dive into what all these commanders do, how they play. If you're not familiar with Magic, no worries. This is a super fun and kind of silly way to play it that's going to be very approachable. Thank you all so much for joining us. If you haven't already, <gasps> give us a follow, a subscribe, a membership, whatever you feel like. We much appreciate it. They don't have memberships here. <laughs> well, I imagine we're going to cross-post this, so YouTube in the future. <laughs> Point at all the camera. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, uh, should we dive on in? Super. Yeah, let's get started. <laughs> yeah. Let's take so it excited to play. All right, so briefly, can we talk about what, what, set, what decks we're playing, kind of what the arch archetypes are? Um, I'll take it away first. I am playing um, Pirates. Uh, this is uh, Grixis, so black, red, blue pirates. It's a lot about uh, stealing things and also graveyard pirates. This is very much like not Pirates of the Caribbean pirates. Uh, so I'm excited. My commander is Admiral uh, Brass, the unsinkable. She's back and cooler than ever. I've got a black, white vampires uh, theme deck looking at um, vampire subtype and then also. Um, an aristocrats theme, so gaining advantage when your creatures go to the graveyard mm -hmm. and you know making the most of it. I love it. Sounds great. All right, I'm super excited because this feels like a homecoming. My <laughs> first deck was a dinosaurs deck, and I'm playing dinosaurs. I'm playing Pant or Pant Laza, the Sun Favored. This deck is just all about playing dinosaurs and going stompy. I love it. Uh, I will be playing blue green Tempo Merfolk. My commander is Hawkball of the Surging Soul. It's got, a, it's got a good soul. So cool. uh, and by tempo, I mean I'll be bouncing your things, I'll be playing creatures that grow, and I'm going to try to kill you before you get good. <gasps> not before I kill you. Uh, amazing. If you're not familiar with the commander, we have 100 card decks. We have a commander that we can summon from uh, the command zone. They get more expensive every time we have to resummon them. Uh, the winner is the last person standing. Uh, we all have 40 health, and uh, the one kind of extra thing I'll mention is, of course, um, a person will die if they've taken 21 points of damage from a single person's commander. That's all you really need to know. Let's dive on in. We're gonna figure, yeah. figure out who goes first by rolling uh, two dice each, and whoever gets highest has the top of the turn. <laughs> huh. I got an eight. <gasps> oh, oh. All right. Whoa, we're gonna, you guys right, we're gonna have to reroll. Here we go. Yeah. Huh. Big money. I got an eight again. Oh, no! <laughs> We're not going to talk about what I got. <laughs> that's fair, that's fair. All right. Get all the bad luck out early. Yeah, yeah. Sweet. We're just going to take it away with Merfolk. Merfolk on tempo going first? I'm a little afraid. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wreck you guys. That can get out of hand. Oh. All right. Okay, so I will play, we'll start with uh, a non-basic. We're going to play Unclaimed Territory, mm -hmm. and I will name Merfolk. Um, I get, do we want to take a look at Unclaimed Territory? Sure, sure, yeah. I'm going to name Merfolk with that, which means I can tap it for any color to cast Merfolk. Um, <clears throat> and then with that, any color of mana, I'm going to cast a Benthic Biomancer. Oh mm. my goodness. Turn one plays. Turn one. It's turn uh, aggressive. Wait, so you don't a, just ramp on turn one? He's a 1-1 one, one that gets bigger. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense to me. All right. And awesome. I'll pass. Sounds fantastic. I'll go ahead and draw for turn. And I am going to go a little slower than Brajar. Uh, I'll go ahead and play Sunken Hollow. Comes into play tapped and pass. Let's see. Ooh. I'm gonna play a Temple of Silence. So when this one comes into play, I'll be very quiet. Um, <laughs> but also look at the top card of my library and decide whether I want to keep it. And I think I do. And oh. I will say, oh. go ahead. What could it be? It's a good All one. right. <laughs> No one's missing their turn when land drops. Good, that's good. <laughs> we know what we're doing. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah. Um, we're just going to start off with a simple jungle shrine. Gives me all the mana I need and nice. comes in tapped. Perfect. And over to Bridger. Cons of Tarkir. You know, we're going back to cons. Yeah. Sorry, we're going back to Tarkir. <laughs> Could be. It probably won't be cons of Tarkir twice. I hope the cons are still there. <laughs> <laughs> what have um, they been up to? <laughs> well, I see your Temple of Silence, and I will raise you a Temple of Mystery. Ooh. Um, so I'll do the same thing. 
Ugin going back to oh, Tarkir. I sure hope nothing has happened to my favorite cons. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I love it. Um, you're right in front of me. I'm going to attack Adrian for yeah, one. Absolutely. I'll you take, take one Benthic Biomancer damage. I will do. I will do that. Sounds like a good thing to me. Uh, I'll drop a turn. And we're going to go with an island. We'll tap it in our sunken hollow for a Rakdos signal. Uh, sorry, Signet. Uh, this is the card, a card that gives me mana, and it kind of lets me convert some mana. Mm -hmm. uh, that's it for me. Over to you, Brian. Um, ooh, I wonder what I drew. I've never, <laughs> I've never seen this card before. <laughs> I always forget. I'm like, oh, oh right. Yeah. I actually knew that technically. But um, it should be a pleasant surprise, right? You're excited to see the thing yeah, that you wanted. Yeah. It is. I can't spell play. scry without cry. <laughs> That's I always, always yeah. cry when I cry. Um, yeah. I'll play a Talisman of Hierarchy, some more Mana Rock, um, and then I'll pass it over. All right. I'm setting up. He's ramping. Yeah. All right. So this is pretty exciting. We're going to start off with Tapping 2 to play Dinosaur Egg. This is actually Ooh. a new card that came out in this Commander set. It's an egg, and when you play more dinosaurs, it grows bigger because it has Evolve on it. And once it dies, you get to discover, which is the new mechanic where I search for whatever, discover X, which is the creature's toughness. This, and I get to go find pretty much a dinosaur, hopefully, which will come out as big as that. That's a really flavorful card. Yeah. If we forcibly crack your egg open, you get it, you hatch a dinosaur. Yeah, I hatch yeah. a nice big dinosaur. And, and it, gets, it can get bigger the more big dinosaurs And the more play. dinosaurs you play, they like sit on the egg and they help right. it grow. That's so yeah. perfect. Yeah, that, that's very nurturing. Works. My favorite yeah. thing is they like use it as a blocker to like roll the egg in front of whatever <laughs> creature you're doing. All right, that's funny. over to you. All right. <laughs> Ooh, um, options. It was like the funniest thing. So my first deck was a like, Gishanth from Exelon, okay, like commander yeah. deck. And I told my friends I was playing with at the time that I'm like, I only want one deck. Right. Oh, that's a funny but, lie. Yeah. yeah. Three years later, I'm up to 22 commander decks. Okay, I want this. This is officially on record because yeah. most of the time you only can claim credit for like half of them. Yeah. You're like, oh, this is for my friend, or this is for my fiance. I'm holding it for your friend. Yeah. yeah. It's always for somebody else. Right. Uh, all right, I will pay three for Deep Root Waters. A lot, oh. of, a lot of cool reprints in this deck. Yep. Uh, Deep Root Waters is an enchantment that every time I cast Ooh. a Merfolk, I get a bonus Merfolk. I get a Hexproof 1 1 Merfolk token. Oh, so, I don't like that. So good. Merfolk. I heard you like merfolk, so I gave you some merfolk with your merfolk. Uh, we're going to spread it around, Brandon. Oh. I'm going to attack you for one. Checks out, checks out. I love it. It's a, it's a slow start, actually. It's funny. You good? Yeah. Excellent. I'll go ahead and drop the turn. Thank you, everyone, so much for joining us. We appreciate it. Always good to see those shiny and friendly faces. Uh, yeah, one deck. Saying just one deck is just like saying one army. Yeah. 40k <laughs> players now. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's see. We can get a bit of ramp going. Three... Can we get to four? No, Beckett is five. Oh, I haven't even four. thought about. Yeah, all the commanders in the set usually are a little bit more pricey. Right. Um, we're going to go for Exotic Orchard. It's a land that produces one man of any color of uh, land an opponent controls could produce. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll go ahead and tap yeah. that along with our Rakdos Signet for four, one of which will be a, a red mana. And we're going to go ahead and summon uh, Gem Cutter Buccaneer. Uh, <laughs> it's very interesting. Let's go ahead and oh. take a look. <laughs> Uh, so when Gem Cutter Buccaneer and other pirates I control enter the battlefield, I get a treasure token. And uh, additionally, I can use treasure as a weapon. Uh, I can oh. equip it, and it gives a thing, uh, which I can't see because it's far away. But oh. it's cute. It gives them plus two, plus oh. Yeah, it's like you bling them out. <laughs> yeah, they're like, what's up, y'all? Yeah. I can, I can... some dangerous treasure tokens. Yeah, yeah right? <laughs> uh, I'm going to yeah. grab a token. Fast you, Brandon. Let's see. On tap. Smacking them with the goblet. <laughs> right. I'm going to, first of all, but on the vampire vampire theme, uh, I'll play Glass Cast Heart. So this Ooh. makes blood tokens whenever my vampires attack, and then um, I can pay life to, to make vampires. And there is a big effect on the bottom, which involves sacrificing 13 blood tokens. But <laughs> Whoa. We'll, we'll see if I, I can generate <laughs> yeah. that much blood. Okay. Um, <laughs> we'll help you out. And then I will How much play. blood you got? Uh, uh, the Red Cross would like to know your location. <laughs> yeah. um, I, I'll play a vampire that generates mana, so I can sacrifice mm. another creature oh. to generate black mana to cast vampires, clerics, and demons. Oh, oh that's fun. That's, that's like cool. a dark that's ritual a on a stick. 
right? Kind of. Yeah, I mean, you yeah, have to sack a creature. Yeah, but... And it's only for certain things. Orzhan has no problem sacrificing creatures. <laughs> it's conditional. conditional. Yeah. It's a very cool creature. That's yep. awesome. Uh, with that, I'll say go ahead. All right. Is, is that a vampire? Do you get a blood? It is. Uh, it's whenever they attack. So. Oh, attack. Mm -hmm. Very cool. All right. A little bit of a slower start for me. That I'll play Path of Ancestry. It comes mm -hmm. in tapped, but I can play any mana that would be within my color's identity, and then if I play a creature that shares it, I'm able to scry. I love it. Great card. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, I can't attack you with my egg, so I'm going to just have to play oh, you're defensive. Done? You're yeah. Nice. I'll leave two mana up for a counter spell. You do have blue, right? Blue's in your... Is blue in no, your... Not, no, not at all. <laughs> there is reprieve and... I would uh, never play blue. Reprieve and mana... Uh, mana tide. Mana tide? Oh, yeah. Uh, okay, okay. Probably not on the deck, but... <laughs> yeah. I know, these pre-cons are packed with power. So They're I wouldn't be awesome. surprised. Oh my gosh. Yeah. This, so the Merfolk deck, I begrudgingly had to put back together last night because I already <laughs> made like a full Merfolk deck out of it because it's such a great start to like a strong Merfolk uh, commander deck. Uh, it's so, so cool. And the dino deck is like yeah. all the dino like, cards you my want. My dino one's one of my main decks. It's already 70% of already like what I'm playing, yeah. but just the upgrades I want from this deck. That's wild. I'm going to cast my first of many lords. Mm. Uh, this will be Merfolk Sovereign. Mm. My Sovereign. My Sovereign. Uh, so it's a lord. It gives all my other Merfolk plus one plus one, and then I can tap it to make target uh, Merfolk unblock. Oh, any creature unblockable. Oh. Merfolk creature. Sorry, Merfolk. Okay, yeah. Tar yeah. yeah. Okay. So my initial interpretation was correct. <laughs> yeah. uh, I, That's of course, great. get a hexproof Merfolk from my Deep Root Waters. Mm. And now uh, we're going around the table, Shane. You're going to take two. <gasps> you, you get You're the worst of it. No, it's not on. Oh. I have a 0 3 egg. Oh, no. Crack the uh, egg. I'm not going to. No, I can't crack it. You can't yeah. crack it, but you're going to get blocked. Uh, it's back to you, Adrian. <laughs> yeah, gonna, oh, wait, good. you have a blocker. I have a 1 3. Yeah, I can't get past that. <laughs> you. Uh, mine's a one-one. All right, uh, Brandon. Oh, no. Brandon, we're no. going to Brandon for two. All I'm, right, my, my my small creature is getting picked on. <laughs> it's messed up. Would you say you were afraid of getting egg on your face? Oh. <laughs> that's a saying people still say. Mm -hmm. I'm still with it. I'll take your word for it. Um, all right, let's see. I don't. It's actually a pretty interesting mana base in this precon too. I think it's. A bit better than what I'm used good? to seeing. I think good. Better than I'm, I, I would say I'm used to. Um, so I'm going to just play a Svamp. So we got that. And you know what? It is time. It is time. So we'll tap all four, including our Rakdos Signet. Make sure mm. I can do this. We can make sure we get, yeah, red, a blue, a black, and then whatever. For Admiral Brass, the Unsinkable. This is my commander. Brandon, if you don't mind presenting yep. her here for all of chat to see. She is returned. Uh, this is a classic character with a new printing. Um, and when she enters play, I mill four cards from my library, which is to say I take four from the top of my um, deck and put them in the graveyard. And then she has another ability that lets me return pirates from my graveyard. Um, to the battlefield? I think to the battlefield. <laughs> yes, absolutely. So uh, I'll take that. Oh, well, Adrian's at 39. Because I initially bonked him with the Benthic Biomancer. Yup, yup, yup. You got, you got, you got so bonked, bonked dude. So I'm going to go ahead and mill four cards. We've got a mountain. We've got a mountain. <laughs> We've got an island. Interesting. And a Rakdos Charm. Okay, cool. Um, so at the beginning of combat on my turn, I can return a target pirate from my graveyard uh, to the battlefield with a finality counter. Basically, this means they will live one more time, and when they die, they're exiled. They're gone for real. Yeah. Uh, and... It gets uh, becomes a four four with haste. Cool. Unfortunately, Whoa. we milled big no pirates, creatures. Big pirates. Okay. Yeah, small pirates that were big. Um, oh. And do you she get comes bling? into play. I get a bling. I get a, a, a tree jour. Yep. And he's a better blocker than he's an attacker. So I will I will stay. Oh, I don't know if I could take another hit. <laughs> it's too much. <laughs> four thirty seven. <laughs> <laughs> the secret of commander is the only health that matters is the last one. You're not wrong. Where's the wizard? you get trucked for like 40 damage <laughs> in one swing. All right, I'm going to have to pay one life to use the Talisman. Mm. I'm going to play Nighthawk Scavenger. <gasps> so this is a classic oh, no. classic oh. hybrid of two cards. <laughs> yes. um, a Vampire Nighthawk, which you know, was the 2-3, had yep. Flying, Death Touch, Lifelink, which was an awesome, That's it's an awesome combination card. of abilities, but also of uh, one of my favorite cards, Tarmogoyf, and gets bigger for, for all the for all the things that are in graveyards around the table and mm -hmm. as they get bigger. So I think we just have two right now. Um, instant land. My yep. graveyard's empty. So instant land and then it'll get bigger as, as time goes on. Very appropriate um, for this set too. Yep. 
I'm going to use my Master of Dark Rites and attack <gasps> Shane, but... Mainly, mainly just gonna generate generate a blood token. It's a one one chain. You can. Block I will block with my dinosaur. He's really oh. excited about this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that go ahead. Cool. It's like funny because I like want my thing to die. I'm like, come on, attack me something big. Yeah. <laughs> I want to crack it. Hit me harder. <laughs> okay. All right. So dinosaurs are all about that ramping. Mm. So we're gonna we're gonna start doing that. So we are going to play. Um, I'm going to lead with Topiary Stomper. Oh, classic. This is, it came out in New Campana. It is a hedge dinosaur Ooh. that when it, it's got vigilance to the 4-4, but it can't attack or block unless I own seven or more lands. Beautiful. Uh, when he enters the battlefield, it helps me get there because I can go search for it. It's kind of like a rampant growth, growth, but with a dinosaur. But because of that, my dinosaur egg now evolves because mm. a bigger dinosaur mm. came in. And so, watch out. <laughs> now my dinosaur egg's got teeth. <laughs> It's one growing. Tooth. One yeah. It has one tooth. A sure. tooth. So a I'm baby going tooth. to so uh, pass over to Bridger while I go search for a le basic land. Perfect. Sounds Most great. Excellent. I'm gonna. I'm realizing that I'm about to vomit so many merfolk onto the table. <laughs> this is gonna get out of hand. This Blah. is. Yeah. There's. There's gonna be yeah. merfolk all over the place. Yeah, we're about to have a merfolk problem. First. Um. Well, it seems like everybody's casting their commanders. Actually, yes. just Adrian. Adrian's casting his commander, so I'll cast my commander. I want to be cool. Huck. Puckball! Oh, so cool. That's what all the popular oh, kids are I doing. I missed. Right? Yeah. I, I did a very poor job of aligning that. Uh, yeah, well, you pull him, pull him down. Uh, so he's a 3-3. Three, three. At the beginning of combat, all of my merfolk explore. Mm -hmm. Is that All of them? Him? Wow. Is it him as well? It's very far away. For um. me, as a human. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, at the beginning of combat on your turn, each merfolk creature you control explores. So I'm going to explore five really times. Good. That's kind of cool. Oh, wow. Really good. Uh, and then when he attacks, I may put a land from my hand onto the battlefield if I don't draw a card. That's just so simic goodness. Yeah. He has a lot of text. They Plus one counters and lands. It's so great because you go wide, then you go tall, and you just rinse and repeat. And you just kill everyone. <laughs> yeah. It's. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm yep. going to. Uh, I got a, uh, another hexproof merfolk from casting a merfolk off my deeper waters. So I have five triggers now at the start of combat. Uh, we'll go left to right. Benthic Biomancer. Yep. That's a land. I'll put it in my hand. Beautiful. I know oh, it's no. like turn four, but does anyone have any of those nice turn four board wipes? I'll put it in my hand. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's exploring. Uh, Commander's Sphere. That's not a land. So I get a counter no matter what. Yep. And then I can choose to put this in my graveyard or leave it there and ensure that the next two also get counters and draw a Commander's Sphere next turn. I think I'm going to leave it That's there. That's so five-brained. Is it, is it graveyard or is it bottom of the deck? Graveyard. Graveyard. Okay. Whoop, whoop. I love it. Uh, that was sick. So good. Draw Wait, two lands you... and leave a commander spear on top? Is the explorer mm -hmm. you can choose to put in your hand? No. No, no. 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 Only, Only if it's a land you have to. That would be yeah. cr Don't be crazy. It's already yeah. very strong. It's very yeah, strong. no. That's... Especially in the color like blue, <clears throat> lots of scry, right. or blue green with lots of scry. <laughs> okay. okay. All right, guys. We don't need to get blue more, more card advantage. Yeah. I, I didn't get the counters where I wanted them, but I also got the land I needed, so... <laughs> Brandon, I know dinosaurs and vampires have had their differences. <laughs> but we may need to form an alliance. Mm. A lot already? Alliances? This the most unholy of alliances. <laughs> I'm just here to steal things. Hey, they, it's official. They had a card. It was... Uh, uh, Galta, Galta and, Ma and Maverick. Maverick. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the ultimate team up. <laughs> it was a begrudging alliance. Okay. I love those, like, best friend cards. <laughs> yeah, the, they're pretty amazing. Wait, that means that there was, yeah. a like, Tatiova and Beckett Brass? What was... Oh, I don't remember. There, there had to be I think it was the Storm. One. Yeah. Didn't they only do one per plane? No. Or... No, they did a few. No, there were a couple. We, we had a, we had a uh, yeah. team. We had a team. I mean, up, this, trust this, me. This sounds, oh, there was a been sounds great to me, honestly. Um, I'd rather not have to deal with this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to deal with The devil that. you know, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, so we got a Death Toucher over there. Mm -hmm. We got a Derpy Egg. Yeah, 1-4. Egg. 4-4 over there. It's developed. No, he can't block. The Topiary Stomper. Oh, he cannot block. Seven lands. Okay. And we're aligned, so... And we're, you know. we're best of buds. <laughs> uh, Shane alert. <laughs> what? Someone in chat. Hog mentality. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here. Oh, we need to put that uh, emoji into, just into Twitch. Into Twitch? The Shane alert one. Should, can you attach sounds to it? Can you just make it like a siren? <laughs> it just scares everyone and happens. I want to strike fear in people's hearts. On Discord, hearts. we do have a Bridger sound effect. We do? I don't even know if you know. Yeah. How do we have sound effects This is news to you. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's really funny. I want oh people to either love me or fear me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> my only good attacks are at you, Shane. Oh, that's a so good attack. So I'm sending a 3-3 three, three and a pair of 2-2s two at you. 
All right. We'll get you an official emoji. Man. I will block the... Um, the 3-3? Three, three? The 3-3, three, three, which yeah. I won't die. I'm actually <laughs> looking for a place to die. Can't die. Uh, but, this was a clever, yeah. clever attack. So she'll take, take four damage. Four damage yeah. down to thirty-six. You were up on your high horse, and I didn't like it. High so dinosaur. Just, this, this. We don't have horses here. It'll be a couple million years. That's right. I'll pass. Okay. The egg is evolving too fast for its own good. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's too powerful. All right, big money. It's developing toes. I don't know how things and eggs work. <laughs> <laughs> This is amazing. Um, yeah, it's only on EPB for that. We'll go for Crumbling Necropolis. Gives me a black, blue, or red. Classic Grixis. Oh, come and play tapped. That's a Khan's Land. Khan's Land? That's from Tarkir. Or was that? Grixis. This was the, the, this other, was the original. The... Shards of a Yeah, this OG. Yeah. Grixis Lands. Grixis Lands. I love that they still print yeah. them and put them in Commander decks. Yep. So... They're great lands. Yeah, yeah. they are great. At the time, they were amazing. Yes, they're affordable. Well, Ractos, Triumphs are just crazy. Triumphs are, yeah. We'll cast Shared Animosity. Oh, um, pirates famously don't work together well, but sometimes they can agree. Yeah, they, something do. That they, they have hate pirate more. crews. That's true, but they don't work well together. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they famously don't work well. <laughs> Anyways, whenever a creature I control attacks, we get plus one plus zero to the turn for each other attacking creature that shares a creature type with it. So more pirates, more beta, um, all that stuff. Um, I think let's have some fun. I don't like what you're doing either. Let's, so the treasures are funny. The treasures you can equip, they cost three to equip, unless you're a pirate, in which case it only costs one to equip, Ooh. which is quite nice. I'm realizing I'm gonna need more treasures, because normally I do more. this. Um, but you gotta equip them around. Yeah, yeah. so what I'm gonna do is, um, I'm gonna do this. So I'll keep this as zero. If this is zero, I have no treasures that are just available. And okay. we'll equip these. We'll equip a treasure to Admiral Brass. We'll equip a treasure to the like gem to cutter form buccaneer. An alliance? <laughs> wow. I'm in an alliance with him already. <laughs> well, it doesn't mean we can't be in an alliance too. I wanna oh, you got a death toucher there. And you have an egg. And I have an have egg. Super, oh man. And we're an ally. Uh. So you can't just attack the Murphy. You can attack me. I hate stalling out. Alright, that's it. That's me. Oh. Okay. Dang it. <laughs> End of your turn. I'm gonna use the glass cast heart, pay one, Ooh. and then pay one life. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'll lose one and then make a 1-1 one, one vampire token with lifelink. Oh, I love it. With light? Oh. Lifelink. As I, as, I, as I go through the token pile. Uh, there's so much now. All right. If I have a... I, I know the answer, but if I have a treasure that's equipped and the guy that makes some equipment dies, do they just have a, a treasure equipped that has no effect? Yeah. I would have to read the... <laughs> no, no, you're exactly right. I it's think it functions might just, just like off. equipment. Yeah, it's it falls so off of him. Treasure oh, it falls off. Yeah, okay. they would stop being equipment. They would fall yeah. off. I thought it would be funny. If he dies, they still stay equipped, but... People forget how to wear their gold necklaces. Yeah. yeah. And it just falls into a pile on the ground. Was well, any of this real? Yeah. <laughs> well, no, I think it's still... Oh. Hmm. No, it would fall. It stops being an equipment and it falls off. Because it loses yeah. the equipment. It loses all of its abilities that yeah. let it do any of those the things. The logical answer, yeah. but I just wanted to like carry useless treasure around. I mean, well, you can still... You still have the treasure. I can't carry yeah. them with me into battle. No. Yeah. You leave them behind like a smart pirate. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> we bury them. Yeah. Okay. I like pipe. Go on. I'm play. <laughs> I had a whole in it. Uh, <laughs> Promise of Aklazots. So. Are you doing the adventure side? Um, what? Or the. Oh, you know, I should actually. I should do the. I'm going to adventure. Sorry. Yeah. So I will, be, I will be playing Foul Rebirth. Gross. Uh, so I'll sacrifice a non, a non demon token or non demon creature. And if I do, I make a 4 3 vampire demon. So I'm going to sacrifice my. Master of Dark Rites. Not your what? vampire token? No. Oh, there's something insidious going on here. I don't like what you got going on here. Vampire Demon. Vampire Demon. This is on the adventure. Cool, cool. Come on, uh, on adventure. And then... Oh, no, I should have attacked to get the blood. Sneaky. Do you want to attack? Do you want to hold? Yeah. Uh, uh, swap it up? Well, everybody We're friends blocked. here. Yeah, I think, I'll, I think I'll just say... I'll think... I think I'll just say go for now. Okay. I don't want to make any make any enemies you want to at the moment. Me? <laughs> no. Oh, this man. is a new, an Ixalan adventure, huh? Yeah, this was yeah. a. I think this was a new card for, for huh. these. For this these is decks. a brand one. Yeah. Alcatraz is the new yeah, bat right? demon who stole the sun. Alcazots. Yeah. Alcazots. He's trying to steal the sun. I can't pronounce like cool. English words when this set's going to be very difficult pronouncing these. Yeah. Yeah. Work through it together. Yep. <laughs> All right. Uh, oceans. Oceans. Uh, Salon or whatever. The oceans 500. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Steal the sun. How many, how many bad right. pirates does it take to steal the sun? <laughs> I would watch that in a minute. 
Let so, us know in chat what everyone's doing today. What are you working on? What are you playing? What sons are you planning to steal? Exactly. Yeah. Anyone yeah, stealing in on the heist. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so this is exciting. This is a new card, which I think is going to be pretty big in Commander. Oh? Okay. This is, is called, Commander, Shane. Yeah. This is called Progenitor's Icon. When it enters the battlefield, I choose a creature type. Beautiful. Type. And I can either tap to add one mana of any color, so it's a mana rock, or I can tap it to give any of those creature types flash. So I can start playing dinosaurs Whoa. on your turn. Whoa. Yeah. That's, that scares me, Shane. Yeah, that's that's not good. Dinosaurs anywhere. Okay. It, and what do you have in your graveyard? Uh, I have an instant and three lands. It's a scary question. Raptor's charm. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I will. My cards are useless. Tap three to play Death. What's it called? Gorge Scavenger. Okay. Uh, which is another dinosaur. So when he enters the battlefield, I can exile a card from target graveyard. If it's a creature card, or he, I gain two life, and if he's a non-creature, mm. he gets plus one, plus one. Oh, okay. Um, since I will exile your vampire cleric. Oh, <gasps> no. darn. Uh, so I will gain two life. You this... cut off the evil scheme of your own ally, Shane. This is not a good alliance. <laughs> wow. He may have been scheming your eventual, eventual downfall, but yeah. that's not cool, bro. Shane's just like, you don't yeah. mind if I just... just... Just Go attack away. you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You're not eating that last wing, are you? Mm. <laughs> um, so you get a counter. And I also get a counter because it evolve is either toughness or power. And you'll heal mm. for two? I'll heal for two. So now I have a 2-5 dinosaur egg. <laughs> okay. Which I am going to swing at you, Bridger. I have a 4-4. Four, four. I know you do. Oh. And you have no open mana. That's what you think. <laughs> I, I block with my 4-4? Four, four? All right. You sure you want to do that? Yeah. All right, it's your turn. Okay, nothing happened. All right, cool. I don't. I'm giving him a false sense of security. Oh, if he it. thinks I don't know what I'm doing, yeah, he won't see what's coming. That was a very emotional, like emotionally charged. <laughs> walk yeah, right it there. always is with these two. You never know what you're gonna get. I was just confused. I was like, you can't have a trick, Shane. Yeah. <laughs> I'm uh, playing I'll... this game on multiple levels, right? And Uno at the same time. I'll play my sixth land. Mm. We'll cast this Commander Sphere that you all know I have. Mm -hmm. Uh, Commander Sphere taps for one color, uh, one man of any color, uh, and I can sack it to draw a card. Cool, cool. Oh, how many merfolk should I cast? All the merfolk. You should have hunted me, Adrian. That was uh, Rotel Dorado. It's a dubia god. <laughs> no? 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 Huh? Kind of uh, appropriate? I mean, yeah, I, I love, I don't, I barely remember that movie. Oh, I remember you, loving the movie. It is a fantastic movie. It is yeah. a great movie. Oh my god. It's Rodel like Dorado. Exelon adjacent. It's like hidden temples and cities. Yeah, yeah, yeah totally. Rodel Dorado and Atlantis. And Atlantis are like, was good. I, those are favorites. Atlantis was great. Yeah. 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 El Dorado's better. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Hot take. Hot. The soundtrack was written by Elton John. I mean, come on. All right, we're going to yeah. progress to the I need two rows to my board state my level of the game. <laughs> uh, I'm going to pay two for Merfolk Mistbinder. Uh, it's a 2-2 two -two Merfolk Lord. And you have I, two lords now. I, oh, my lord. We're double lorded, so that gives me Ooh, uh, Hexproof Merfolk. Mm -hmm. And then I'll pay two. You guys got any Wraths? You're going to need a Wrath. We're going to yeah. need a Wrath. Uh, oh, my G. I'm going to oh. play a Coral Helm Commander. This one has a lot of text, so we should probably... Okay. Looking to you, right, Brandon. Here. This oh, is a wow. weird one. This is a level up card. This yeah. is from the original Zendikar setting. Yeah. Um, so it starts as a 2-2, and I can pay one mana of any color, yep. a bunch of times at sorcery speed to put level up counters on him, and we ha when he has enough level up counters, his stats change and he gains new abilities. Uh, so he'll gain flying, and then he becomes a lord. Yep. Everybody levels up to be a lord when you're a merfolk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Dude, they have so many. They have a lot of lords. They did not reprint Lord of Atlantis, though. Uh, they well, it is in the new Exelon. They did do a new alternative art. It's just not in oh, the. Oh, is it the same the game store? Yeah, is it it's the Lord game of store one. Oh. It's Lord of Atlantis, but I think it's just one of the art cards, or maybe mm -hmm. the friendship. They have a new term for like the guest stars that come in. Oh, it's on, the, it's on um, guest yeah. appearance, special appearances. There's yeah. another one. Anyways, we'll come back. Special to guests. It. Yeah, it yeah, was one of the first guests. cards they actually previewed for the set. Huh. I thought all the special guests for Ixalan were artifacts. But anyway, I have um, nine explore triggers. That's a lot. We're gonna. Uh, we'll start here. Not a land. Okay. Um, so he gets a counter, <laughs> and then this is actually gonna pop another trigger because whenever he gets a counter, I draw and discard. Uh. I really just wanted the two life, but what? now I'm, I'm kind of worried. What's a polychrome? <laughs> 
<laughs> I don't want that. So we're going to bin that. Oh, bin Then it. I have a uh, draw discard. Oh, man. Is that uh, a sorcery? Uh, that is an instant. Is an instant. Okay. It's just, an, I'm counting for my first scavenger. You're just so. curious. Yeah. 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 I'm uh, asking for a friend. Yeah, yeah. Uh, With flying death touch and lifelink. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> asking for a flying death touch lifelink friend. I'm discarding another instant beast within. What oh. the? Oh. This is another instant. Uh, this explores. Oh my That is Lord. a land. Lanowar Reborn. This explores. Yeesh. That is a land. Oh man. Hackball explores. Not a land. Merfolk Skydiver. Ooh, that one's cool. Not a card that I really want, but I do oh. like counters. So Hackball gets a counter. And then if I just leave this here, I get counters on the next five creatures, mm -hmm. which is pretty cool. Uh, DM, I do that. He's a problem. Ooh. He's a problem. He's a problem. We're this, not even talking about the game. Problem. Just like in Boop. general. Just for sure is a problem. Boop. Can confirm. Boop. Oh, Does that blow him up? No. Level up counters are different, oh, okay. but I'm yeah. realizing now that I need a, a different yeah, a color, color of dice. Yeah, no worries. I have yellow dice for level up counters. Perfect. Um, boy, oh boy, are you guys in trouble now. Yep. This just became arch enemy. <laughs> I'm double lord and have a million merfolk, ah! most of whom have counters. <laughs> uh, that's cool. This is cool. Shane, uh, this is cool. This is cool. This is pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. That was not as cool as that. Why did you attack with your egg? Oh, no. I can't explain to you now, but one day. <laughs> that's a 3-2? Um, he's just a 3-2, yep. Okay. Didn't exile a creature make him bigger? Uh, no, you get life for exiling a creature if you exile a non-land oh, card. Okay, all right. I still don't really understand Adrian's board. Yeah, I don't yeah. know what's happening over there. <laughs> well, um, he's got pirates playing dress up. <laughs> you have death touch, and I really love how many merfolk I have. He has one death touch. Yeah, so I can't three. afford to lose. Too. <laughs> I can't afford to lose any of these merfolk. They're We're all in the negotiation phase. precious yeah. to me. Why are you going to attack anybody? Shane is virtually defenseless. <laughs> virtually, what the? <laughs> <laughs> he is tapped out, but as we know, yeah. that won't stop him. Yeah. I feel really bad, Shane, because you are, you just went shields down. You just... <laughs> I got one blocker. All right, so this, this is a 3-3. Three, three. This is the only thing you could kill. And I will. <laughs> so we're, golly, this board. Are you, okay. are you threatening my 3-3? Three, three? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to send, you have a 4-3? Four, 4-3 three? Four, three and, yeah, yeah. Okay. And the Death Toucher, 2-3. I will send this 3-3 three, three Hexproof Merfolk. At, at you, Brandon. Okay. This alliance might be short-lived, Adrian. I'm sorry. <laughs> wow. I'm, I am the arch enemy. There will be consequences if you attack me, I'm just saying. I, yeah. There's I be, guarantee it. I, there's going to be consequences immediately from all of you, because <laughs> I have... The, the surge of the river has really <laughs> wiped out some villages here. Um, have you got any of those destroy <laughs> permanents? Destroy all my folks. Yeah. Hackball is going at Shane, and I'll get a trigger for that in a second. So we have a Brandon, we have a Shane. All right. Uh, this is a Lord. No, wait, wait. You wait your turn. While you're while you're thinking about your attackers, um, I wanted to also shout out. This was from a little while earlier. Uh, Hog mentality is uh, should be painting their Drakari, but instead playing Battlegrounds in WoW. What's up? Oh yeah, I need to farm up honor before Tuesday. Yeah. Or... Shane promised Tuesday after the patch okay. we're gonna start doing twos in arena. Yeah. It's gonna be great. Should find, we should stream that. <laughs> oh, that'd be fun, actually. Yeah. Where was I sending that from? Um, it's a lot of crying. It's <laughs> a lot of crying. Yeah. A lot of frustration. Shame. Yeah. And if you all, if y'all haven't already, definitely give us a follow. And if you have a, um, the bridge is like, wait, it's all Shane. <laughs> <laughs> a subscription to give, definitely much appreciated, helps support the channel. Many people have, of course, Prime, not using it, uh, that Prime uh, Twitch subscription, so we'd love to have it and have your support. Uh, let us know, of course, what other content you'd want to see. We've been doing all sorts of things, from painting to playing games to uh, mostly those two things. It's been great, but all right. let us know. Okay, Adrian, yes. it's just, it's a little bonk. Okay, a little it's bonk. It's almost the smallest bonk I can give you. Okay. Uh, so I'm making Doubtful. this Merfolk unblockable. Okay. So you will take five. You made an enemy for life. Adrian loses <laughs> five life. I am sending a, a mere three three hex proof at Brandon. I'm gonna I'll, as a I'll bait. Be, I'll be taking that. Okay. <laughs> so Brandon will lose three life. Don't trust that. Uh, I am sending Hawkball, the surging soul, Hello. and my benthic biomancer at Shane. This is a four four, and a seven seven. <laughs> I'll block the 7-7. Seven, seven. I don't want to take 7-7 seven, seven commander damage. So Shane will lose 4 life. RIP Death Gorge Scavenger. <laughs> and I barely knew ye. Put a land into play. 
Beautiful. Which will be Land of War Reborn, and I graft one. His counters are moving everywhere. Ooh. Yeah, it's too everywhere. Much. Yeah, no worries, Fugs. We're not going to be doing video games here, regardless. We're sticking to um, just not non video basically. games. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's my, that was my epic of a turn. You, you can go now. Andrew. Okay, well, you know what? You did make an enemy for life, but I understand you got to do what you got to do. Get, look, the river told me, it spoke to me. Yeah. The river runs red. Can't, you can't be boating around on my river. So right? you made a very your, big deal of permit? pointing out that you have no counters in that deck. I don't think I have any counters. I'm also, also tapped, tapped out. out. You're also yeah. tapped out. I don't know. I don't. He'd be like, oh, my merfolk flips over for a counter. Yeah. That would be pretty cool. Turns out it's actually counter spell. Um, I'll ask the question that every commander player at this point in the game loves to hear. How many creatures are on the, are there on the battlefield? Oh, is this a blasphemous act? It's at least 13. I, think. I got two. I have, three. <clears throat> I have like 100. Oh, sorry, I don't need 13. I just need eight. Uh, well, there's eight. I okay. have <laughs> nine. So, so I had this last turn, but I wanted to. I was hoping the alliance would hold true and mm. take a bit more damage. Unfortunately, Bridger did not. So okay. if you don't mind putting this on good old Quintorius, yep. we're going to play Blasphemous Act. Yep. It costs nine mana and deals 13 damage to each creature. However, cool thing about this card, it costs one less for every creature on the battlefield. So it's just costing that one red mana, and everyone's going to die. Beautiful. Thank you, Adrian. Someone I had knew you it. had it. Now my dinosaur egg pops. I know, I know. And we put so, in the pull position. So I look for a oh. card that, that is five or less, and yep. I can either put it in my hand or onto the battlefield. Sounds great. Oh. All right. Yeah, first card is a enchantment. I like that. Uh, this is one of the new cards oh, okay. that's coming out in this pre-con called Descendant's Path. Whoa. At the beginning of my upkeep, reveal the top card of your library if it's a creature card that shares a... Creature type with a creature you control, you may cast it without paying its mana cost. If you don't cast it, put it into the bottom of your library. So it's just, every turn, it's like Harold's Horn that's gone insane. Yeah. I just reveal, if I control a dinosaur, I get to play dinosaurs. I love it. Now i got to figure out how to get dinosaurs out before my next turn. <laughs> uh, I love it. All right, that's I'm... insane. That is, a, that is a really good enchantment. It's really strong. I'm going to tap two, three, four... For a fifth mana using the Rakdos Signet, we're going to bring... Uh, oh, sorry. I'm actually going to be one short. So I can play one you land. Put treasures. Oh, I have treasure! Treasure. treasure! Do I want to... We'll do this. We'll play a Smoldering Marsh. Um, and then I will tap everything, plus the Signet, and one treasure. Thank you for the reminder. Uh, to bring Admiral Brass uh, back. She costs two more because uh, I'm, this is the second time I've summoned her. And we're going to go to Milltown. Let's do it. So we've got oh. Zara, a island, Ghost of Ramirez de Pietro, and a Broadside bomb Bombardiers. Ooh. Now, this is the unfortunate part about a stream where you're playing new decks. Uh -huh. I don't know what any of these creatures yeah. do. <laughs> yep. Brandon seemed to like Zara, but I have no idea. Um, I actually like Bombardiers better. You like Bombardiers better? So Bombardiers is a 2-2 Goblin Pirate Menace Haste. Um, it has Boast, so I can sacrifice another creature or artifact, like Treasure. Deals damage equal to two plus the sacrifice permits many value, which would be zero if it was treasure, um, to any plus target. Two. That's good. That's like a nice little little shock. Uh, De Pietro can't be blocked by th things with toughness three or greater. And when he deals damage to a player, um, I can choose and it returns things to people's hands. And then Zara is a 4 3 flying. Whenever I attack with a defending player's hand, I can put a creature from it onto the battlefield under my control, tapped and attacking, and then it goes back at the end. Okay, I do actually like those broadside bombardiers. Mm. Why does this matter? Well, we'll go to combat. Um, and then Admiral Brass will trigger. I don't have to be attacking. It's just combat on my turn. Return target pirate creature card from a graveyard to the battlefield with a finality count counter. So the broadside bombardiers will come back. They're now 4-4. Mm. Um... And they have haste. Ooh. Oh no. Tempty. Tempty. I think who has the most life? Bridger? Oh, oh me. For we sure. need to take Bridger yeah, down. We'll swing on Bridger for four I damage. Four. That's gonna be it for me. Uh, end of your turn, I'll use the glass heart and make a one one vampire pay one life. So I'll go down Ooh. to I think thirty five or good. lower potentially. Thirty yeah. something lower. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll have a vampire. That's I still have life one. to pay, that's all that matters. Yeah. I was getting in there punching. <laughs> right? Oh mm. my gosh. All right, where well, everyone can be cool now. We can all chill. No, I'm Turn. back to punching. <laughs> <laughs> only punching. Merfolk only punching. Now, they grow really fast as yeah. a scary We're part. at that really cute point of having six mana with dinosaurs. Cute's the right word, so yeah. You, no. So we should punch you? No. Well, I yes. <laughs> He's not so good at the politics part of this. <laughs> Would you punch a dinosaur? 
He's like, I'm the strongest. Don't attack me. How big is the dinosaur? <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll play my commander, Cavalino, first Ooh. of the blessed. So going on the uh, aristocrats theme, he makes other uh, vampires? Other vampires into demons, and then they uh, they leave behind tokens and give me cards when, when they die. So that's, that's a plus. That's cool. I love it. So uh, I will go to attacks. I will attack with this. 1-1 one, one Vampire, which gives me a blood token. And lifelink. And lifelink. Uh, Oof, who you poking? Sword through. Getting poked. Uh, I'm going to poke. I'm going to poke you. I'll take one. Mm -hmm. And he'll gain out. one. I'll gain uh, one. The alliance we'll remains strong. Blood. Hog mentality, we're playing retail. Uh, my family's playing uh, Wrath. I don't have time for that. And this is a, yeah. this is a demon vampire, so I guess I'll, I'll mark it with the yellow. Sounds great. Yellow dice. Uh, I've got some extra mana, so I'll cast now. I'll just say go. Cool. All right. Cool. So I don't have any dinosaurs in play. That's um, true. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, thanks for calling that out. <laughs> yep. I know why I did They're it, not but sneaky. it's really funny. They're not hidden. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <Yep. laughs> All right. I'm going to play Thriving Bluff. Enters in tapped. These are like these new, like, they always make bad lands when they make mm. these commander decks. Yeah. But they're like, so it's kind of cool. It's, it's a little bit of color fixing. So it comes in tapped. I choose green. Yeah. So it can be either red or yeah. green. Yeah. Cool. These were from Jumpstart. Yeah. Uh, I fundamentally disagree with this mechanic in paper. Yes. Oh, now you have to remember to of, for the rest of the game yeah. that the, you named green. Yeah. Three, four, five, six. It is, it is an easy naming green. Uh, door's right there, Brandon. <laughs> you can see yourself out. <laughs> no, no, stay. I want more of this. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you came for, chat. That's <laughs> what we came for, let's be honest. <laughs> All right. Um, we are going to tap five mana, and you know what? I'm gonna ring up my commander. I think it's about time. Oh, yeah. So I'm gonna summon um, Pantsalaza. Um, when she comes in, I get to discover for whenever a dinosaur enters the battlefield. If... Get that card, no? Sorry. Pants, 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 Laza. No, just yeah. pant Laza. Pant Laza. Um, discover, and it's whatever the dinosaur's toughness is. I can discover so. And that includes herself. Oh. So when she comes in, discover four. That's great. Wow. What the heck? All right. So lands count. Is it non lands or? Non lands. Okay. Non land with. Uh, yeah. With cost four or less. Mana value four or less. Yeah. Okay. All right. And I will bring out. <gasps> um, Odapek oh, Huntmaster? Odapek Huntmaster. What? I don't know what that does, but it sounds cool. It's an OG um, Xlon card. Yep. Uh. So dinosaur spells cost one less to cast. Ah. And um, I can tap him to give targets dinosaur haste. Mm. Oh, jeez. They're fast. Um, he's no. great. He's just, yeah. He's does one he of have... the few non-dinosaurs that run in my dinosaur, like my actual dinosaur deck. Does he have haste himself? He no. does not. Okay. So there's uh, a little he's... reprieve. Yeah. Cool. And he's a one-two. One-two. You could shock him with your treasure. That's shocking. Okay. Um, and I can only do her ability once per turn, so it's not like every da dancer can storm <clears throat> out. Mm -hmm. But it's just a nice way of getting them out. Um, and that's me, so I've got two guys out and over to Bridger. Mm. Yeah. I'll draw this Merfolk Skydiver that you all know I have <laughs> from ages ago. Love it. Play another island. The funny thing is I had to play, but your Merfolk Skydiver was what was stopping me. Yeah. What? Yeah. Really? Yeah. It's just a flyer. Oh, yeah. You don't want to know. <laughs> oh. That was a key part of it. Oh. Yeah. Okay. You don't like things that fly? Oh, dinosaurs don't fly. That makes them dragons. No, but <laughs> Zatulpa. What about pterodactyls? But there's a bunch of flying dragons. Dinosaurs. Okay. <laughs> there's oh, a bunch of he said it. There's actually in the new the set, there's actually a Draco dinosaur. It confuses me. What? Yeah. It's... Both dragon and a dinosaur at the same time. Like you can't have that. Mm. Is it? Did Sahili make it? Um, I'm going to cast Branching Evolution, okay. which oh. is a, a doubler, but only of one one counters, and only for me. You is love this one, one one counters. Me? Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, this one's only for me. Uh, so now all of my one one counters. Oh. That What's are the one for on everyone? Creatures. I forget what it's called. Uh, don't know. I forget. Yeah. yeah. No, this is real good. Two, three, this is a big money four, card. Five, How many six. times do I have to teach you, Bridger? Stop doing things. <laughs> <laughs> AKA, how many times does Adrian have to teach you? <laughs> I'm gonna pay six 
to cast Huckball oh, no. of the Surging Soul. Ah. That gives me a Hexproof Merfolk from uh, Deep Root Waters. The 1-1 one, one counter from Lanawar Reborn grafts onto Hawkball, becoming two 1-1 one, one counters from Ooh. Branching Evolution. Synergy. You wow. thought synergy was only a corporate term. No. <laughs> synergy is a no. merfolk term for winning. Your dog, your dog, I heard you like synergy. Uh, I have two explore triggers to start dog. combat. So Hawkball will explore. Yo dog energy. Oh, it's a land! So Stupid Hawkball. Uh, the land is Alchemist Refuge, for those who are curious. Uh -huh. um, and then the Merfolk will explore. Metallic Mimic. Ooh. Oh, there's another potential Lord. Oh, oh yeah. No. It's all Lords all the way down. Uh, so Lord with a, an E. A 1-1 one -one counter that doubles from Branching Evolution, and I'm going to leave Metallic Mimic there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the team. And that, that's my turn. I pass God. to Mr. Dude, Adrian. Thank you. God, it just gets so big so fast. It's only two creatures. You're only two creatures. I know you're building this exercise. So this gets you excited. You're like, oh, I don't like these war crimes that are about to be committed against me. This is the game me. version. I'll yeah. tell you what, I'll put yeah. an end to it. This is pretty chill, yeah. This is the, to the chill version. Yeah. Uh, he's, well, he's well, the only thing he's adding plans. is right. counter spells. <laughs> uh, that's true. Well, they just have so much of it. The, the power of the deck is one of those decks where like no card, no individual card matters. Right. Everything is good. Yeah. So counter one thing, they'll play the second thing. Mm hmm. Um, hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. I really wanted to swing, but then suddenly he has a board. I have a 5-5 five, five and a 3-3. Three, 5-5 three. Five, five and a 3-3. Three, three. Yeah. I have a 4-4 four, four and a 1-2. I can broadside you for 4 um, on Hawkball if I wanted to get rid of my Signet, which maybe I should have done well, before This you. has Hexproof. Yeah. And that's a 5, five. Oh, I don't the 3-3 three, three is fine. That's what I'm saying. I can do I 4. You can only do it once because it's the boast. It's not a is this, unfortunately. Oh, okay. Is that like when you play it? Boast when is attack? when you attack. Or boast is when you attack. This Once the creature attacks, then you can do it at any point during that turn. Once. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, cool. I feel better then. Yeah. It was not a mistake. Boast was a short-lived strange mechanic. I've never heard of it. Time? Yeah. yeah. I liked uh, it. I thought it was really cool. Seems perfect. Uh, I'm I like the not entirely sure what it actually does. It, pl it makes you attack. It's like kind of cool to give abilities to creatures and also say you right. have to attack. Uh, we'll so play... it's like reverse goad or? No. No. Okay. No. Not even. <laughs> uh, we'll play Daring Saboteur. It's a 2-1 that can pay 3 to make it so they can't be blocked. And if they deal combat damage to a player, I may draw a card. If I do, discard a card. Um, little, little looter? It's cute. Little, little looter. Little looter tutor. Adrian, do you want to create an alliance? I'm making no promises right now. Uh, <laughs> He's two, on his own team. Yeah. Three. Everything's very volatile right now. We'll play Commander Sphere, which is just a little Ooh, mana rock. That's a good one. Yeah. I like that. And then, do I actually need more mana this turn? I've got two and a tre treasure. I can't say it on Treasure. Treasure. I've ruined you. You have ruined it. Um, just think you guys you've, get like you have, you have some pirate options I can in there. Bring pirates in, which is super fun. Uh, okay. I don't necessarily need mana, so I will just play Terramorphic Expanse, and later on we'll be sacrificing that to we'll get a land. It. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I think we'll go to combat. Mm -hmm. So in combat, we're going to trigger Admiral Brass's ability. Of course, I can re return a target pirate. Uh, creature from a graveyard. Gem cutter is interesting because then I can start getting treasures again, treasure. which lets me ramp and get equipment. You didn't say like a pirate. I don't hate that. Treasure. The oh, they're all interesting. This is cool. Get a, get a pirate hat for the next. Uh, yeah. the next we should have done costumes. Yeah. I thought about it. How do you dress up as a Murpho? Yeah, yours is the you're the problem. Not gills. the dinosaur. Blue We're gonna get blue spray paint. Put yeah. gills right right here. Right. Just cut my yeah. neck open. Uh, what is it? The Triton? Yeah. Oh, the, Triton! Yeah, we have a Triton uh, in, our, in our large costume closet. Do we? Oh, we do. From our no, surprisingly actually. large costume closet. Right? <laughs> uh, we'll bring in Zara. Zara feels like the right move here. So she's um, a four-three flying, and uh, she has ways of bringing stuff in that you control. Perfect. Oh, she's a four-four now. Yeah. So now we'll actually go to to the fight in time. You have no flyers. Uh, yeah, yeah, no flyers. Okay. You have no flyers. No flyers, a 2-2. Two -two. No flyers. You, you have big stuff. Okay. 4-4. Four, four. Yeah. My biggest I got. Big uh, cards in hand? Uh, I don't know, a bunch? Yeah. Four? Four. What is... Four. What, what is card... What is cards... In, what? Who um, has cards Zara in hand? can take stuff from your hand for the turn. Do they get haste? Uh, they get haste when they come in from... They, uh, they can't, they're coming attacking. Dude. It's super cute. Did I get brass? I know. Oh, gains haste until end. Yep. Oh, if mm. they come in attacking. No, gains haste until end of turn. Okay, okay. She uh, she Got gives it. them haste. 
Who gives them haste? Oh, sorry, yes, Admiral she gives them haste. Press. I'm talking about Zara yeah, yeah. now. Yeah, yeah. So we'll put Zara into Bridge R. Is it 4-4? Four 4-4 four? Four flyer. Four flyer. Oh, okay. And 2-2 two, two will go, I'm a little nervous. I don't have Death Touch, theoretically. I feel like I need to be a uh, Griechev. So we'll put the Broadside Bombardiers into uh, you, Brandon. Yep. And Shane, Pant Loss is a what? A 4-4. Four, 4-4. Four. Four, four. I'll put Brass. No, Brass will just sit back and wait. Yarr. Uh, so they're each getting plus two, plus zero, Ooh. from the shared animosity. And then now let's talk about Zara. So Zara, when they attack, look at defending player's hand. So Bridge R. Yeah. Oh, thank you. And then I can put a creature from here tapped and attacking. Me. Yeah. Thank you. Zara. Well, you have one creature. No, you have I two do. creatures. But one of them is, I think, better for you. Oh, yeah. The Skydiver. Mm -hmm. Yep. So... Dude, you could proliferate your finality counters. Think of it that way. It could be very fine. Whoa! You I wish could, I could do yeah, that. Yeah, I was like, oh, that, that doesn't do anything. Well it, do, well, it doesn't help you. That would be funny, though. So you get my Skydiver. Um, and we're going to put a plus one, plus one counter on... Sure, let's do Zara. Yeah. Mm. So we'll hit Bridget for five, unless mm. there's something weird. Six, counting the... Six? with Because that's tapping and attacking me. So I take six. Uh, any blockers? Brandon? I'm gonna take six. Yep, sounds good. All right. I think that's it. Sorry, I know that was a long turn. And then this goes back to me. And it goes back to you. Perfect. So I'm gonna do two things at the end of your turn. I will pay one life, yep. make another vampire with lifelink. Excellent. I'm gonna sack this land to get a Montagna. And then I'm going to use one of my blood tokens. Uh, so I have to discard a card. I'm gonna discard Blade of the Blood Chief and then draw a card. Perfect. Ooh, Blade of Blood Chief's good though. He doesn't want it, okay, Shane? You're playing the dinosaurs. <laughs> He's playing the vampires. The dinosaurs are playing me, you don't understand. Are you guys talking about taxes in chat? Ew. Is the game that bad? Why? <laughs> taxes. You were talking about how I wrote off the Edenesque costumes. Yeah, all yeah. Our costumes were yeah. It's all business, man. Wait, I, okay. So you yeah. guys don't, now that we're talking about taxes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You guys don't just do the auto, like the generic deduction? Uh, oh, I don't do taxes. No, you, you deduct what uh, is ta his taxable income. So we do the auto deduction, but then we tax everything out of our income to make what the taxable income is. I don't know how to do that. I like commanders they're, they're, that avoid paying commanders. They're, they're going to have to have a discussion after this regarding, <laughs> regarding uh, the taxes. <laughs> we'll do a We're not giving official a tax this is advice. Not a tax advice. <laughs> I don't pay taxes, I just keep it running. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Never catch me. I love it. Is that saying everything is free if you can run fast enough? Or fake your death enough times. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on like the third iteration of Shane. <laughs> That's why there's the Y on this one. It's yeah. Kind of weird. Ooh. <laughs> So you have to share the lit. Oh, well. You know that? You <laughs> yeah. Keep it safe. Keep it safe. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm going to play <laughs> Bajuka Bog. So this will come to play tapped, but. Oh, no! no! I'm going to get rid of some pirates in the graveyard oh, so they don't no. come back. Yes, oh, you just so got Bee Bogged, bro. It's gone. So my graveyard is gone, which means I can't be pulling stuff from it. I need more pirates to die. No more Beckett Brass. How many pirates have to die <laughs> until you were satisfied, Brandon? Thousands of them. <laughs> um, <laughs> they'll be built on an altar of blood. No! <laughs> I'm going to play, so we, I've had this sitting out for a while, so I'll play the Promise of Aklazots, so great. make, potentially get some, get some token, tokens going game. here. Oh, it's like, not exactly lightning them. <laughs> so, at the end of, beginning of my end step, I can sacrifice a non-demon, if I do, I populate. Cool, cool, cool. So let's see. Whoa. Now. Whoa. Now it's That's here. Pretty good. Dude, all these weird mechanics and then coming if, out of... Right. Um... I will attack with. You don't want that see. smoke. Oh yeah, this this board is getting a little messy right now. <laughs> um, that's, that's probably correct. Uh, Would you like to form an alliance? <laughs> I've, I've heard that a lot. I feel. Like. <laughs> um, oh no, he's learning my secret tech. Did we just become best friends? He also saw nope. in front of us how the alliances are worthless. <laughs> <laughs> you immediately attack the person you made an alliance. I always with. forget the old ways. <laughs> I will. Oh, uh, my tokens can can be copied. Oh, you know what? Okay, I will attack. Uh, 
Watch that finger. You put that down. You put that finger down. I'll point it over there. I'll point it over there. We'll we'll, we'll be careful. He was Um, like ready. um, Tech with this vampire. So this is the one that's already a demon. So it's a 4-3 flying? No. Um, It's just, it it only makes the 4-3 when it dies. Okay. So it's just a 1-1 with life lane. Um, Demon vampire. I'll take it. Okay. Take one damage. He gains one life. Remember this. Oh, you didn't want him to get the demon? Is that is that what that weird play was? I was the arbiter of life and death here. Mm. <laughs> you could just let him have the demon. <laughs> I, just, I want my cards he's, and my demons. He's, he's your fl- ally. <laughs> is he? If he has flying, then they can't. What's it called? Dinosaur keep flying. Yeah. Dinosaurs to... fly. <laughs> How many times do we have to talk about this? <laughs> I've never seen a flying dinosaur. All right. Uh, you missed. The, the... <laughs> yep. That's your so. Okay. This is going to be exciting. Oh boy. Uh, you want to share share with the class? Yeah. So I'm using Descendant's Path. I reveal that a card, and look who decided to oh, show no. up. <gasps> no! Uh, scary. Zakama. So Zakama is a classic, one of the elder dinosaurs of um, Ixalan. So yep. when, usually if you cast him from your hand, you untap all your lands, yep. and then he's just a Vigilance Reach Trample, 9-9, nine, nine, and then you can pay three mana of various types to do some really cool stuff. Mm-hmm. Uh, good. Um, I did my wrath. Someone else so has to do it now. He comes in, you just get any any size. It's just yeah. really share type. This is you the really exciting part. Is he mouth. comes in, and then he'll trigger Panthlaza's ability, which now I get to discover seven. Uh, yeah. nine. 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 No, toughness. Seven. Nine. Is it's it toughness? Nine. Yes. That's also mm-hmm. nine. Nine. He's a nine. I thought he was a seven. He's a nine nine? He's a nine nine. Gishanth is a seven seven. Okay. All right. This is, this is, oh, God. So, looking for a non-land card that costs... Less than nine. Nine or nine. less. There you nine. go. All right, and so I'll bring in Quartz Word Crasher. That's a good mm-hmm. one. That's a that's a really Fun cool card. one. Oh, these go on the bottom. <laughs> every time. He's the worst about this. <laughs> um, that's cool. Every time I deal trample damage, I take all that damage and I like make a nice dinosaur oh. soup. Ooh. Make a beast. And I make a big di- no, it makes a dinosaur. Dinosaur beast. That is oh. the total trample damage combined. Oh. Mm. What have you been talking about? <laughs> what have you been talking about? <laughs> All right. Oh man. But like, so we're not huh? done with Crazy Town. I got rid of Crazy my Town is still happening because oh. <laughs> Zakama is Zakama. also going to bring his best friend with him. Zatalpa? No, because flying dinosaurs don't exist. I'm gonna tap five and I'm gonna play Atali Primal oh, Store. No. So Atali is like the most fun card in all of Commander. Well. There is when he enters the battlefield, I take the top card of everybody's oh. library, and if it's a spell, I can cast it. I'm gonna sack my commander sphere and draw this metallic mimic. No! Oh. I wanted the metallic mimic! Sorry, dude. You can't have attacks, my metallic when it attacks, though. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh it's when he attacks. Oh, it was ETB. God. Oh, the new good. one's ETB. Oh, that's okay, my okay, bad. Wait, but he can give it haste. I can give so, him haste. Oh, watch that out. Is, that is true. So things, things may be true. I really should have uh, blasted when I attacked. I forgot about the blasting. Should have got blasted. I should have gone blasted. So. Boast is so weird. Oh, and I forgot to draw for turn. Oh, Probably too late. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> he got too excited. Hi, chat. Yep. So. Well, dinosaurs. Dang, I would have board. tapped differently, but that's my fault. So we're yeah, not going to go for that. Fault, Shane. Too excited. Yeah. Who are you giving haste to? Um, you, I think I'm going to give it to Atali. Uh, okay. All okay. right. I'm going to repeat the play that I I can't. I was so excited about taking yeah, well, it. Like the whole you can't th- have it. That's the whole reason you can't have it. <laughs> That's very smart. That's very smart. Okay. You can also do this, Adrian. But I don't know what mine is. Well, yeah. I'm about just to, to be out. safe. All right. Yeah, Are you, you tagging? Just yeah. to be safe. <laughs> so you've got a 2-2, two, 1-1. Two, one, one. Um, you have a bunch of things, but it's tapped out. I have a 3-3 three, three and a 2-1. All right. I'm going to attack Adrian. He's got too much. What? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so I guess we'll okay. give you... So, and hold on. Do so Tali's going at Adrian. So we have Declare Attacker. Uh, um, I will attack you at Pantlaza. Pantlaza. I'm going to change his name like four different times I can't here. believe. And so it does that. And oh. that's all my attacks. Declaring the... So everyone give me your spells. This includes you. This includes me? Yep. Oh, okay. Can't believe um, you hit my Simic Ascendancy? Put it down, let us see it. Yeah, this is it really keeps... exciting. <laughs> Drover of the Mighty. He's so bad. Huh. <laughs> um, this is a dinosaur buffer. Like I needed more of those. Okay. 
So I get to cast all of these. Mm -hmm. I don't get that because it's a land. It's only spells. Which is battlefield. I lose two life yeah. and then I create what? It's exiled. Okay. Exiled, okay. Yep. And then Oh, Primal Simic Ascendancy. Yeah. yeah, that's cool. It was my alternate win con. Yeah. That was actually very achievable in this deck. Right? <laughs> all right. <laughs> it's the alt so, win con that was gonna happen. Oh my God. Mel, I will lose two life and then I'll create two treasure tokens. Can I get one of your treasure tokens? Treasure. 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 All right. And whenever one or more pirates you control deal combat damage to a player, <laughs> exile the top card of that player's library. <laughs> yeah, and they pass that pilot. card yeah. as long as it's How exiled. How many pirates you got there? Mm. I, I got one. I don't deserve it. Okay, so Brandon, um, my commander's coming at you because Drover the Mighty came in. Um, oh, never mind. Drover, Drover gets bigger. Drover, Drover gets bigger. gets bigger. Yeah. So a four four, and then a six six going at you, Adrian. Six six with trample. Wait, so no trample. Is, no trample. Yep. Can I see uh, oversized? Yep. It's no one has trample. It's no. only when oh, I okay, deal. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Quartzwood Crasher only when I deal trample damage. Okay. I'll take mine on the face. Uh, I will also take. So four. Adrian loses six and Brandon loses four. Okay. Um, I should check my life. Okay. <laughs> Just lose life forever. Um, I'm at twenty nine. Oh, jeez. So yeah, it's like the, like 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 the tax thing. I'm just running my life total on vibes. <laughs> I will. <laughs> it's like the tax thing. <laughs> I'm, my last thing I'm gonna do is crack these two treasures. Treasures. and tap one of my lands to cast cultivate, and then why is I cultivate? You can't permanently steal his treasure token. Oh, that's gonna <laughs> give it back eventually. It's temporarily oh. stolen. Um, so I'll cultivate while Bridger oh, does things. Play my turn. Yeah. Most excellent. I don't know what that message means. It's not in English. Uh, <laughs> Wasn't Brandon's commander. Didn't Shane attack Brandon with a commander? Yes. Okay, oh, so, so I'll take four You take damage. four commander damage. Yeah. Yes. Gotcha. So he'll have four of the darker orange. <laughs> Brian made this. Thank you, Brian, for the colors of this layout. Appreciate. Um, Appreciate, don't hate. <laughs> Whew, okay. Uh, so... So you're our best friend now. <laughs> I am? We I, need to deal with this. I uh, laugh wrath. I think you guys uh, should try to be my friend by force. Then I have to beat you after everyone else is dead. <laughs> uh, so I'll play or I can lose with dignity. I know there are more board wipes in these decks. Uh, I'll play Alchemist Refuge, which is a repeatable make all your spells have flash. So that's kind of cool. Very nice, very nice. I like that. I like that. The persecuted alchemist fled deep into Kessig's wilds. Poor guys. In case you were curious. Um, I'll pay two colorless for Metallic Mimic, the card that Shane wanted so badly. He's so cool. Uh, he's a, a lord. <laughs> of any type. Of he could have been type. a dinosaur lord. And that type is Murpho. Mm. Um, and he is a Murpho. Or no, Shapeshifter is only that creature type on a battlefield. Is he? Well, no, I think it counts as any creature type. Oh, he's not a changeling, he's a Shapeshifter. Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. so no Murpho. Yeah. So I did not cast a Murpho. Correct Mundo. Um... And he only is that type when he... So now he's a merfolk because mm -hmm. he entered. Yeah. He is a merfolk right. now. But not on the stack, so deep, ro deep root waters does not work. Uh, I'll cast the merfolk skydiver that y'all knew I had. So mm -hmm. I get my merfolk off of the deep root waters. Merfolk skydiver entering lets me put one counters, red as two counters, on a creature I control... So you don't get to pick the order to make this trigger for your deep, deep root waters. Uh, deep root waters is cast, and uh, that is only a merfolk when it enters. Cast. Okay, yeah. okay. But if this was a changeling instead of a shapeshifter, right. yeah. 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 Now we have a real question of does changeling work on the stack or is it only on the battlefield? Right. Um, two counters. I, I, I believe it's changeling counts as it's all creature types at all times. Does it also get one from mimic, or two, I guess two um, more from mimic? But I imagine somebody probably gets oh. extra. Yeah. So it comes with four counters. Oh. Why is it two from the mimic? Because it's doubled. <gasps> every, all, every, everybody. So just for reference, folks, when Bridger plays a merfolk, um, they're going to get an additional counter from the uh, mimic, and then uh, branching evolution is going to double it. Double it. And then the skydiver itself comes in and puts a counter yep. doubled separately. So skydi merfolk skydiver is now a five five. I feel outclassed. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we'll go to combat. <laughs> And in this combat, I have five triggers of Explore. So we'll start with Huckball. Uh, not a land. Tributary Instructor. So he gets two counters. Mm -hmm. boop, boop. Oh, that's a good card. 
Uh, mentor, whenever a creature you control with a one counter on a die struck. Oh. Oh. Yeah, we're going to leave that there. Never gets two counters. That's pretty cool. Mm. Like that? Horrifying. Oh, you're leaving that oh, for like, oh. like that? a Tali cool. to cast? <laughs> <laughs> I trust that a Tali won't be there. I'm trusting that's, other people. That's a lot of trust. Trusting other people that a Tali won't be there. If, yep. Yeah. Trust. Whoops. <laughs> What's trust. Doopy? Fingers crossed. Uh, yeah, you'll you'll figure it out. You, you're a smart guy. Dude. Hello, good news for you. First time chat. Hey, hello. How's it going? Going great. We're having a good time hanging out, playing cards on a Sunday. I love Commander. Yeah, it's fun. I love dinosaurs. You know what, Shane? I found a way around your silliness. What's your? What do you got on tap over there? You got a 9-9. Nine nine. That's quite large. I got a 9-9, nine nine and then I got some big beasties. He has Vigilance, Reach, and Trample, so if you try to fly around me, he'll just punch you in the nose. Excuse me? <laughs> you heard with me. His, with, his, with his dinosaur arms? Yeah. Yeah. Excuse me? He's just taller than you can fly. Yeah. He hits um, the ceiling of Exelon. Brandon, I would like to attack you and turn your thing into a demon. Yeah? It's no, only no when his stuff attacks. I just need to attack. Oh, you can't turn it into a demon? No, I can't turn it into a demon. I need attack. to attack with this 7-7. Seven, seven. You can attack me. No. <laughs> you can attack me. It's okay, fine. I will attack you with a seven seven because I just need to draw this okay. so that Shane can't have it. <laughs> Shane is not building a Dino and Transformers deck. So but, uh, is that? I'll take seven. Though I am. Whoa, very... you're not gonna block it? No. Well, I don't. No, I don't want to. Attack that's you. fine. That's fine. I'm. I'm totally fine. Play with win. Okay. okay. Well, I just wanted to draw the card. That's all I wanted. His Which, Transformer deck is pretty good though. I've, yeah. I need these. What's really for exciting? Other things is that Exelon has a lot of vehicle support for pirate ships, which go great in my Optimus Prime deck. So Brandon Adrian will hates it. seven regular damage and seven commander damage from me, and I, it wasn't how I wanted it to go, but... Oh. <laughs> this isn't how anyone wanted this Over to, to go. you, Adrian. I don't right. want to win like this. I just wanted the It's okay, card. I have 14 more. <laughs> 14 more, and then I, I don't know what the actual life total is still, so... The only health that matters is the last. 20, yeah. 20 That's hopefully. what Shane taught us. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, there's like... There's stuff at the top of chat. Are people gifting things? What is that at the top of chat? Oh, there's yeah. A, there's a gold one in a present box. Wait, how did we miss this? Thank you, uh, Ragao one for five uh, gifted subscriptions. That's wow. awesome. Thank you. Appreciate thank you. it. Thank you. happen early, maybe when we were loading. Thank you. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Um, yeah, thanks. We never forgot about you. You're good. No, you're good. Appreciate it. This is that card that you can't. Uh huh. What are the next cards better? What are the next cards are in other, like your wave goodbye? What if you put a better card on the top? Yeah, <laughs> yeah for sure. Wait, I would love for you to cast my wave goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'll tap two, uh, we'll tap, tap Screen for two mana on Rakdos, Rakdos Signet. Behave yourself. And <laughs> a Swamp for Black Market Connections. This is a great Ooh, card. I love oh, this card. So good. I'm kind, this is another one I'm shocked is in this pre-con. Yeah. This is a money card. So at the beginning of my pre-combat main phase, which we're already in, so this won't trigger this turn. Correct. Um, yeah. I get to do one of these things. It's it gives you, you have to do at least choose one, one or more. Well, do you know one or more? I thought it was always one. No, yeah, choose this one is one a way. fantastic card. That's awesome. It gives us all those options. Uh, oh, yeah. thank God. And new art that originally came out in Baldur's That's Legends cool. of Baldur's Gate. Yeah. Yep. This was from the Baldur's Gate Commander deck. That's really cool. Yep. Uh, I'll play Thriving More, comes into play Taft. This is the one where I pick another color. We'll pick blue, I guess. Seems to be what we have the least of. I have no cards in hand. Oh, first one. Exactly where you want to be. I win, yeah. Uno. Yeah. Uh, and then we'll go to combat. <laughs> I have no graveyard. <laughs> we have bigger problems, Brandon. <laughs> We okay, need to set all aside. My, all, all the problems are over there currently. I know. Come to I me. Know. Embrace the comma as I, Lord and Savior. I will pay three to make the Daring Saboteur unblockable. Oh, oh no. He's got you there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Uh, you have reach. Do yeah. you have flying? I have a six, seven, seven fly. Seven, seven fly. <laughs> it started as a one, one. Oh, no. <laughs> Cards in hand? Uh, a four? I would recommend not attacking me. Oh, yeah, you would say that. I will I say have that. four. Four. Oh my gosh. You will see soon. I don't want to attack Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> you can. I. What's he at? He's got. He's got twenty health left. No. Attack me. So I'm thinking about Zara because Zara will let me pull something from the hand and cast it, but then it's most likely only going to be used against Brandon, and that's not really my goal right now. So I'd rather keep it as a blocker. Bombardier. We could. We can bomb something with our sphere for five damage. Oh. I don't think we have. I mean, there's the haste. 
Your haste duder is still You can kill my commander, which is a big one, or the haster. Is it five damage? Oh, because it's the cost yeah, of that. So it's plus three plus two. Yeah. So that's pretty spicy. Um, you can kill my pirate. <laughs> Actually, it, it would go back to, your go back to my graveyard. But he would kill your Zara. Uh, but then you can yeah. steal cards. No, no, yeah, yeah. I'm not. I'm not doing Zara for sure. So we'll do daring saboteur into Shane. Ah. Yeah, take that. And then we'll do staying. The only thing we're considering is the bombardier to be able to bomb one of Shane's good cards. Uh, you could bring your commander back easily next turn. Yes. But then you'll be mostly tapped out, so that's nice. And I don't know if we do we even care about the haster at this point. Mm. The discover feels like it's a bigger problem. I can I see my pirate again. <laughs> yeah. Does this pirate do anything? He mm. exiles a top. He steals a card from the top of your library, and then Adrian can play that when he touches mm. you. Yeah, when, when, a he, pirate. when a pirate does it's it. To so he's good for me to have. So he's yeah. very good for you to have. He's actually a fantastic pirate commander okay. if you wanted to do Demir Pirates. I will... Sorry, I'm going to swing Ramirez on... Ramirez de Petro Pillager. I'm going to swing on you with the Bombardier. Mm. Oh. Menace and Menace. Yeah, Menace. Very menacing. Yeah, so that's six damage Menace. <coughs> uh, six four. And then Shane, you can't uh, block. Isn't it just I a can't four four? Block. It's a four four, but then but it gets... It, oh, shared oh, for shared shared Um Sorry. And Shane, you'll take four. I'll take four. That's cool. what I can do about that. When we attack, I'll sacrifice the Signet because the pirate is only a four three. Four yes. three. So this will Sig deal two. Two. So it'll deal four damage. Oh. Good. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. So this, what I'm doing, uh, chat, in case it's not clear, because probably not, killing my own pirate that he stole to go back to my graveyard because next turn Brass will be able to bring him back and actually do stuff. Um, so Shane is taking four. Brandon is taking six. six. <clears throat> and I am going to draw a card because we did damage to a player. If I do discard a card, yeah, you so might as well just filter it and kill so the pirate. One. Yeah, yeah. Well, that is a pirate. Don Andres, I like it. And this is in your graveyard as well. Yep. Rebuilding that graveyard. Yeah, yeah, no problem. You've got things in there. We're good. You've got choices. All right, over to you. Right. Sorry. Thank you. Um, yeah, I feel like I have choices. weird long turns. I will <laughs> pay another life, so I think I'll go down to. 13? Oh, jeez. Oh, Very low. I'm going to make another vampire. I'm going to have to I'm gonna start blocking soon. Um, <laughs> and I'll also use one of my blood tokens to discard and draw a card. I'm going to discard Heirloom Blade. Draw. Sounds good. He's going to hit us with the dam. Which I is mean, in that deck. Which is, is in the deck. Oh, yeah. does, he, does he got it? Does he, you got it? Oh, I hope he's we'll got see, it. We'll see. We'll see. I hope he's got it. Uh, draw. He's got a blood <laughs> if he needs to... Find. He needs to dig one dig, card dig one. <laughs> one in 80, the one in 80 shot. you got to yeah. descend into your deck. Um, yeah. Exelon. Bum, bum, bum. Bow, bow. Bow, bow. Bow, bow, bow. Uh, Good to see all the happy faces in chat. Hopefully everyone's having a lovely day. Playing some magic today. It's fun. Yeah. And then Tuesday we'll be back on uh, YouTube playing a narrative game. Oh. Uh, which is going to be really fun. That's fun. Uh, I'm going to play Yeheni Undying Partisan. Oh, so this is... Undying Partisan? <laughs> undying. Classic. Undying. Oh. Um, so this, this enables the sack theme, but also can uh, stick around and is a pretty good threat on its own. Yeah. Um, Very cool. Are they the only Kaladesh vampire? Is Bilal... I think all of the, all of the Aetherborn... Oh, are vampires? Is mm. Gaunti? I'm trying to think of Gaunti. I thought they were most... Gaunti was a zombie. Yeah. I, mm. I could be wrong Tommy on all vampires. of them. Lots of lots of questions. I could be wrong on all of them. Uh, I didn't really four do mana, I don't mana. like that. Okay. Uh, I will... <laughs> Anything you need. You want me to block it? I'll block it. No, I just... Anything you need. I just, I just need... I'm going to attack. I will make the blood have this become a demon. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You want me to not block it? Anything you, you want. Can, you can do whatever you want. Any, you These actions friendly. are telling me that he's planning for a future. <laughs> <laughs> so... Um, um, so it's just, it's it's a demon now. I'll take yeah. one, and he'll gain one. Ooh, I like it. Oh, I've gotten gotten my life back. It's Major Mineral. Yeah, we're bringing narrative games back. Let's go. Narratively. What are the factions? Uh, or is that secret? Not yeah. yet announced. Oh. Well, we have a vote up, I think. We'll find out if John posts the vote. Live. So he did, I'm he going did. to Perfect. second main. I'll sacrifice... That four mana. I'm going to sacrifice so this vampire. Uh, yeah. Make it indestructible. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's... And, 
Oh, and it oh, is. Oh, it oh, is happening. Oh, oh. You, you gave yes. me the cold shot. Um, I'm going to play Dam, so. Yeah. Overload it. Let's go. Ooh. So he's going to destroy, uh, pay the overload cost and destroy each creature. Oh. Yes, that gets yep. around Hector. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Oh no. Yeah. No, we're good. My finality counters. So wait, how many creatures died? Uh, need a one, a five for me. Four for me. Six for me. Four, five. That's nine. Uh, fifteen. And then whatever you have. Oh, big Yeheni. Okay, so Yeheni is a seventeen, seventeen. Now. Oh, how the turntables turn. Um, and then I'm also going to get wait, two. <laughs> one commander tax. I'm also going to get two vampire demons that come into play tapped and draw two cards. Oh, finally, finally, back. finally getting getting some right. getting some advantage here. Um, well, barnacles. Ah. And then I'll say I'll say go. Imperial fist currently in the lead for the narrative game on oh. Tuesday. I like me some imperial fists. All right, so I have to at the beginning of my upkeep reveal the top card. I don't mm -hmm. have it, anything that can be shared with. But we get to know. Yeah, so go Xenagos. So this goes at the bottom. Xenagos is in that deck? Yeah. What? The, the, but it goes the at the bottom. Oh, yeah. Man, that's insane. Goes at the bottom of my library. Okay. And, okay. and draw. That's good news. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'll play a game trail. I have a forest, so it comes in untapped. Um, You're getting a little static on your mic, Brandon. Cool. Yeah. All um, right. Yeah, maybe just. How you doing, Train? Also, uh, I'm doing okay. Yeah. I'm going to that's tap cool. six mana oh. to play. Will you now? Uh, Regal Behemoth. Ooh. I'm putting that over your card. Do you want that back? Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah, by the way. Um, so, Regal Behemoth, Pretty. which is, it used to be a lizard, but they actually changed its type oh. not too long ago to make it a dinosaur. But the big thing about him is he's got Trample. It's a 5 5. Um, when he enters the battlefield, I become the monarch. All right, oh. all right. So that's that's fun. That monarch is now in the game. So what does what does monarch mean? Monarch means at the end, as long as you control being the monarch, you get to draw a card at the end of your turn. If anyone deals combat damage to you, they steal the crown from you and become the monarch. It's fun. All right, so it kind of gives an extra incentive to attack me, but gives me extra draw. Mm. But the nice thing about Regal Behemoth is he also makes it so that uh, whenever I tap a land for mana, I can give myself additional mana or. Er, He's a mana doubler when he you're the monarch. He doubles it. Wow. Mm. Only while you're the monarch? Um, yeah. Only while I'm at the monarch. Yeah. Okay. okay. I'm actually going to reverse cool. that. So then I will have... You no know reverse card. Mm. So I will have now six untapped mana mm -hmm. um, to play... Exciting stuff. Um, Welcome. Uh, first time chat from uh, Karloki123. Broke would swing the 16 out of 16 and had haste. Oh. This one? Yeah, Henny wasn't huge until post combat. Yep. I wanted to get my, my vampire demon value. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So I'll play Runic Armasaur. Appreciate it though, thank you. Um, he's a just 2 5 dinosaur that whenever an opponent activates an ability that, of a creature or land that isn't a mana ability, I may draw a card. Well, that's not okay. Yep. So. Whoa. Um, end of my turn. I get to draw for the being the monarch. <laughs> I okay. can be a monarch. You can be the monarch. I'm the monarch. Well, yeah. questionable. You, you uh, just need like a hasty flyer. <laughs> Don't be hasty. Ooh, actually. Oh, there's, 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 there's some ways. things. Yeah. <laughs> there's, there's possibilities. I, I got, I got a nine, nine mana admiral brass available. <laughs> you have your ways. I do have my ways. <laughs> All right. Two. How much so we've had two resets so far. It's possible. Well, I see some. I see enough mana floating yeah. around there. It's, it's precisely nine, I think. Two, two, four, six, eight, nine. Yeah. <laughs> and then. Oh, Ooh, and a treasure. And, and I could have more treasure. Seven, seven, yeah, yeah. Mm. Okay. Okay. Nine manias. Is. Treasure. I want one more treasure. Treasure. I pass. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's where we are. All right. Let's see what we got. Big money. Hup. Oh, uh... Technically, I yet. didn't wipe any of your boards. They were the ones Well, doing... you made it necessary to wipe the board. <laughs> so you are still the villain. <laughs> we're back oh, in the Stone man. Age. Oh, man. Uh, so we're at the beginning of my pre-combat main phase for Black Market Connections. 
I would like to tra create a tree as your token. I will lose one life. I would like to uh, draw a card. I'll lose two more life. Make a shapeshifter while you're at it. I three life for that. You don't life need three six two. life. Where am I at? <laughs> yeah. What did I draw? You don't get to know. Oh. Uh, you also don't get to know that. Before oh, you okay, okay, that's true. That's true. Twenty-five. Mm, three life is yeah. pretty steep. Yeah, mm, pretty steep. It's pretty a pirate. Steep. It is. I a would pirate. pay it. Ah, uh, too I, steep. I pretty frequently pay six on that. All right, fine, I'll pay it. These guys are telling me, and they, they want what's best for me, so I'll pay three more life. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. We know what's best for It's yeah. a three, two color shapeshifter. Most importantly, that mean is, means it is a pirate amongst every other thing. Now I can look at my cards. Mm. Card Those are some good cards. <laughs> uh, we're we're going to pay lots of mana. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. To bring in Admiral Brass, unsinkable once again. When she comes in, I'm going to mill four cards. Blood Money. Oh, that was a board wipe. Uh, <laughs> really? Wayfair's Bobble. Is that a new board wipe? Yeah, I've never seen this before. Blood Money. Good name for a card. Seven mana, destroy all creatures. For each non-token creature destroyed Ooh. this way, create a tapped treasure token. Oh, that's but, pretty good. But they're good. tapped, Adrian. That makes it fair. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. I like this new way that they've been trying to balance treasure because treasure's been a little too crazy. Mm -hmm. Is that they're making them come in tapped now. So you yeah. can't, like... Immediately get the mana. Exactly. Yeah, and then combo about. off of it and do crazy things. Um, I like it. It's, it's nice. It also we, means that they don't have to, like, cost things up. Yeah. So, you know. That's true. Yeah, we'll go to combat. Come on, you wizards. Uh, I hope you see this. Brass is going to return a pirate from my graveyard to my hand. Yeah. Uh, to the battlefield. Sorry, to the battlefield. If you swing at me, I'll swing at you with the full Time force. stream navigator? Ooh, that's a good <laughs> one. That's He's a pirate that travels time? It's, it's, an, it's an extra turn. turn pirate. And it goes to the bottom? Yeah. Yeah, there's some loops with that card. Whoa. Just a grapple. Whoa. And then when he enters the battlefield, or? No, it's pay like seven. Pay it's four. four. It's pay four, four tap. Four. For an extra turn. Oh, ooh, with the haste? That's. Oh, but it's attack. I know you're right? excited about that, but it getting an extra turn. But if you do that, I'll get to draw an extra card. Whoa! Yeah. He, see, Shane, <laughs> in his extra turn, he also draws a card. That's crazy. I don't know if you know that. <laughs> Madness. Adrian did not know that. He's actually really excited about that. <laughs> you guys are breaking. Oh, that I'm... one card was the difference between yeah. taking the turn or not. Yeah. He'll draw two cards because he's gonna pay six life again on his extra turn. Um, wait, what is it? So yeah. ascend. If you control ten or more permanents, you get the city's blessing for the yes. rest of the game. What yeah. the heck is a city's this is blessing? Original, it's just uh, uh, original it's just, Ixalan. Yeah. What does it do? Nothing. It, it, it just signifies you have had ten or more permanents with, the card. and then it might trigger some yeah. other things. Yeah. Other so cards. The thing a lot that of those cards. Ascend, yeah. These. This doesn't move, it's just you have it or you don't have it. So. Uh, yeah, so okay. you, you would have the city's blessing. But what does it do? So you, well, the most card of, that says ascend says what it does when you have the city's blessing. Yeah. It just says ascend. But then keep So it. you can only activate it if you have the city's blessing. So it's it's meant to, you know, you can't play this Early and activate game. it yeah. on turn three if you have uh, the okay. There's a so. pretty popular dinosaur that's like, a, you can play extra lands, but it only becomes a dinosaur. Gotcha. If you okay. have the city's blessing. I'm going to take Ramirez de Pietro. Uh, Wait. Yep. <laughs> It uh, comes into play with finality counter. You get uh, you lose two life. You gain two treasures. Yep. So I'm gonna lose two life, Mel. I'm gonna get two more treasures. Three. Treasures. We have haste. What do we have? Bridger has nothing. I have flash. You watch out. No, you don't. I do. <laughs> <It's right. laughs> Alchemist refuge. You don't. Oh, Look, I've even arranged my lands no, such you that don't. it's very clear. Mm -hmm. I'm learning to be a simic player over here. All right, I'll stay. Go ahead. <laughs> All Here's right, bluffing. all right. He was wow, bluffing. I made it all the way around the table with the the seventeen seventeen. Yeah, That's I got nothing. Surprising. Wow. I mean, I guess we've we've Don't been like a blood money. I have a lot of one tap blue mana. I don't oh. trust you. I mean, could be anything. If you activate your flash, mm -hmm. draw a card. That's not true. That's my creatures. Nope, it's lands as well. Oh, you think I just say crazy things on stream yeah, all yes. the time mm -hmm. without thinking about what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. What? So, I'm gonna. Activate my glass cast heart, pay one, so I'll lose one. I'll make. <laughs> I hope he like just doesn't keep track of it, and eventually that's what kills him. <laughs> yeah, I'll, make, is, I'll make a vampire. He has life, Mike, right? No. Oh. But uh. Well then. Well, but there's 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 some changes will happen. Oh. Okay. Uh, I've enjoyed that each of us has popped off this game. I'm gonna play Exquisite Blood. So this <laughs> this is my this is my. Well, Wait, this, that got reprinted in there? This is my. What? Come back into this. Well, oh no, this is the. Uh, 
No, yeah, this is the wow. Uh -huh. wow. So now, now, now I'm gonna start paying attention to my life total, um, oh. and other and everybody else's life total too. Uh, Nobody better lose life. Yeah, yeah. cut that so out. So people, people are going to be losing some life. Um, and I will, hilarious. And I will potentially the gain that much life. Right. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Brandon's just gonna win. Two yeah. card combo win. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. And we're just like, cool. Uh, All right. So we'll go to combat. Day. We'll go to combat. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna send the vampire demon. At you, I'm gonna try and get that monarch. No, I want that monarch, and then I will send Yehenny over at Bridger. Don't move that. Oh, I have to aetherize. Oh, it gets around okay. indestructible. Uh, no, uh, oh, I gotta tap. This. No, <laughs> uh, uh, you remember this, Shane? I will keep you alive. <laughs> It was the chosen right. one. Aetherize. I'll return oh. all attacking creatures to hand. <gasps> no. Uh, oh, no! Turns out buying my allegiance is really easy. <laughs> <laughs> no! So ah. Penny will go back to my hand. Very sad. Yeah. I was just talking about how we just popped off. Winning. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to what, 19 life? I'm not losing 19. Yeah. I only have like 23. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, we're getting, we're getting close to the bottom yeah. of the drain here uh. for all of us. So go to end of my turn, and I will finally use Promise of Aklazoth. So I have a vampire, I'll sacrifice it to populate, and then I'll get another vampire demon. Beautiful. Mm. Nice. Proud of you. You're so populating. Oh, so populated. Go ahead. All right, heart of the cards. Is it a dinosaur? No, it's not. It was a forest. It was a we forest. We get to know that. That was a forest. I know. He, he like, keeps he his just, cards He himself. doesn't, you know. yeah. 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 It's All for right. the whole the, class. The shame is eternal. I'll just <laughs> yeah. it to the bottom really quickly. Uh, uh, I can't believe there's lands in this deck. Uh, I know, the worst. That's how I feel. start with eight lands. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. that's cool. That would have been a fun one to just get off the flip. <laughs> no talking about hypothetical turns. Yeah. That's a disallowed. <laughs> what? It's okay. I mean, you have, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You have 18 mana. 18 mana, okay. Why do you, why do you have them all? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I know, that's a curse. These are actually all unique, which is kind all of right. crazy. So, so you can feel them dead. Here we go. One, two, three. Animal. And tapping the progenitor icon for seven mana that I will bring in my commander. There's a. She'll will come back. Her? Will he? There's no counter spells in this deck. <laughs> um, so. You descend four? Yeah, I descend, or discover, discover four. Discover. You're going up. Hey, there we go. Why are you still going down? Um, uh, is that? Sideways? This, so I just discovered Rhythm of the Wild, this which is, is a... Good. Shane discovered Rhythm? Oh, yeah. Thank goodness. So this is a classic. It's actually a new art for the card, oh. but um, from the original um, Ravnica, uh, my creatures can't be countered, and then when it enters the battlefield, I can give it Riot, which is either a plus one, plus one counter, or Haste. Joke's on you. We don't have any counters. Yeah. That's still Domni Raid in the art. They gave it new art, but it's still Ravnica. Yeah, it's weird, right? It's yeah. still Ravnica. It's a weird choice. Very. And you didn't sing the song, Shane. I sang it for you. There's a but song? This is the rhythm of the wild. The wild. Um, Ooh, yeah. No? Copyright Nobody? takedown. Nothing? I was yeah. doing Rhythm yeah. of the Night. One, right, two, same song. Three, just it's, four, as soon five, as it's the wild, it's parody. Yeah. It's allowed. Oh. Uh, six, six, twelve. That's yeah, the we song. got the tax. It was so good, I thought that was an off. original song. <laughs> Plus, I was doing the Moulin Rouge version. Okay. Oh. So, <laughs> it's different. It's much faster. I'm... It was the rhythm of a night. <laughs> that's like, that's what it is. Yeah. Um, Shane's still counting. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Tapping, so this is going to be a total of <laughs> six mana to play Thrashing Brontodon. Okay, Thrashy okay. B? Eight, so he'll come two in. Two floating. Two floating. Um, Did you say it's six? Four, six, to play a new dinosaur, Earthshaker Dreadmaw. Let's share with the class. Um, I'm going to give my guys haste as they enter in. So this one is fantastic. It's six, six, dre colossal Dreadmaw, uh, except it gets trample, and then when it enters, I draw a card for each dinosaur I control. Uh, so I'll rebuild. just... Rebuild my hand really quick. They did not put mm. enough rats in these decks. One, two, three, four. Yep. There are five, so that's five. Uh, oh, it's other night. Wow. No, yeah, other, so I get four cards. I have maybe one more in this. Four. I have nothing. Oh, I have a... Uh, you have some unsettled. River hug. River water hug? Yeah. Uh, uh, wave goodbye. Yeah, wave goodbye. All right. There's another one, too. So oh, no. Aetherize, I cast All it. my homies have no, haste. I think I'll be one more. 
And yeah, you remember that haste? Remember. Yep. I saved myself in the 1919. <laughs> um, I forget. I am going to send... If I die, I'm ending the stream. Ending <laughs> um, my commander at Brandon, <laughs> Ringel Behemoth at Brandon. See, it worked. <laughs> and then I'm sending these three at Adrian. Ah! <laughs> Your commander's Quick, just a four, stream. right? End just four, line. four. Okay. Like and subscribe. All right, you got trample? Yes. Everything? Thank no. You the trample. So the trample I'll let you gone. decide mm. how you want to oh, okay. block these out, and then... I'm going to block your commander with this. With okay. Even. Okay. So we go even. So he dies. And then a 5-5 five five is going through. Uh, that's going to be... That's going to go through. Okay. So Brandon will take five damage. And hopefully gain some back over there. There's no pluses on these? Nope. I'm cracking mirrored landscape while you deal with this. Okay. That's my blocks. Okay. So you'll kill my shapeshifter and do three. I will take three trample damage. Okay. Um, nobody dies here. Okay. And mm, you I die. die here. Okay. And I will spend one mana to sack him. Uh huh. And I will destroy your black market connections. <gasps> <gasps> no! Oh, no! I want to play this game! You got Thrashy Bead, bro. That's a classic thrashy okay. B play. That's true. That is a classic thrashy. Do you have to be attacking to do that? No. No, I just you just can. So yeah. I'll gain I'll gain three from the three that you lost. Yep. Ooh, and oh. I forgot how that card worked. Oh. Yeesh. All right. Okay. I didn't kill you guys fast enough. No. <laughs> um, that's me at the end of turn I draw. All right, Bridger. Still the monarch. Oh, he's ta he tapped all his dude bros. Yeah, I tapped hey, that. Hey, he was all tapped last turn. That 25. was why. <laughs> yeah, that's true. 25, huh? 25. God, that deck is ridiculous. You Your just, deck's ridiculous. You just explode onto the board so fast. <laughs> I don't have haste, okay, Adrian? Uh, the haste is a problem. There's like... a lot of haste in that deck, like from multiple sources that give it to multiple things. Ooh. Yeah, it's, it's fantastic. I'm really I'm really impressed. I'm like with drooling, all these decks. excited about this one. <laughs> up, like the idea of just updating my Gishan deck. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, where you're just like, oh, these are just straight up better dinosaurs. Yeah. With all the other weird stuff I have in my deck. All right, I can't just pass another turn cycle. Oh no. We're gonna take take bets on who we think is gonna die first. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's know what you'll think. Yeah. Uh, it's <laughs> it's one of those buttons at the bottom. Oh, that's good. I'm it's playing pretty uh, fast and loose, just being like, you know, something? here's my open board. That's but how I, I prefer, like, these games where we're, like, testing out the things. Like, yeah. You just go for it, and you want to see as many I think my deck just is really good at just slamming dinosaurs into people's faces. And, yeah. It's like, deal with me or die. Yeah, we should have killed you sooner. We, yeah. That's definitely... He's not even talking about in the game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Uh, I'll go to combat. I cast my commander, Huck Ball of the Surging Soul, uh, which gave me a merfolk off of Deep Root Waters. I'm going to go to combat, explore... <laughs> So good. Uh, we got Coppola, mm. Warden of the Waves. Francis? Sophia? Co co <laughs> yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was thinking, nope. Uh, we're going to put in there. two counters on each Jesus. of them. Oh, um oh my G. Uh, and I pass. Uh, did you get Merfolk tokens? I did. You got one. Oh, sorry. Yeah. yeah. Cool, cool, cool. I'm scared. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah? Does it deal with all of this? There's not mm. that many dinos over there. They're all tap. We're like, we just need to do 25 damage. Yeah. Bridget, you did not do your part. I don't have haste! <laughs> <laughs> I have uh... flash, but it's expensive. <laughs> I just love... That is my favorite color, and I love it. Just like, cool, green, have big creatures. Right. White is, be friends with all your creatures. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and okay. Red's oh. fling them at their face. Okay. Um, one, uh -huh. two... Yeah. Three. Uh, I'll keep it blue. Three. Um, Corsair Captain. It's a pirate lord. Oh. And when okay. it is battlefield, create a treasure token. Whenever we say that, we're talking about treasure. Treasure? Treasure. Treasure. Yarr. I like there's different eras of you just saying weird words weird. You guys go to it, and it's only until you find a new word to, like, <laughs> destroy. <laughs> it's so true. Uh, the pronunciation guide. Yeah, also. it's like for, like, yeah. Yeah. no, not even that. It's just like, ah. For like two months, it was like in it for. In it. Yeah. Well, I will be going to England soon, so that will reset. That's coming back. That's coming back. Yeah. When are you going to England? Uh, like this two month. weeks. 
Yeah. Oh, you soon. tell me. I, I'm got, like, playing You're not invited. <laughs> this is just, this will make him stop time. <laughs> our mounted archer? Anchor. Anchor, okay. <laughs> it's an anchor I shoot off of my arm. Yeah. Uh, it gives the creature plus two, plus two menace, uh, which is cute. And um, whenever it deals combat damage to a player, I get a draw a card and then... Discard just two cards unless you discard a pirate. Perfect. Do they know what an anchor is for? You're it's for lock? stopping oh, anchoring it in your face. Why would you mount an anchor I'm on your arm? Because it's for stopping people. When you throw an anchor at someone, they're going to stop. <laughs> um, I'm going to equip... No, sorry, I'm gonna equip for free because it costs two less to equip if I have one or more, one or few fewer cards in my hand. Which you do. So put that on a Beckett. Oh, that's a funny. Right? How <laughs> lucky you. Um I will sack four treasures. Uh Ooh. sorry, that's a, that's a lot a, of treasures. That's unnecessary. One, two, three, one treasure Yark. to play the Biden of Thassa. <gasps> oh, that's gonna awesome. actually save Adrian. It's gonna well, it's gonna help me. So whenever one creature I I control deals combat damage to a player, I may draw a card. I am pointing at Shane. Shane. Yeah. Why would he do that? Uh, we'll go to combat. I wonder. Admiral Brass will bring a pirate back to the life. Yar. Um. You har har. I think <clears throat> I I'm gonna be dead unless we can kill him. So I'm gonna do what I can. That here, is true, Brandon. Um, I, I appreciate it. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Oh? I was going to do him because he's bigger, but everything becomes a 4-4. Four, four. Yep. So let's do Time Stream Navigator, because that's fine if that ends up happening. And it comes in with a finality counter. And, and I'm not really stealing anything this game. Shane's You're... stealing mo stolen more things than me. Uh, uh, here, you can have the city's blessing. Yay, the city's blessing! We're swinging on Shane with everything. <laughs> oh, does Time Stream have haste? Or... Yeah, everything it's has haste, haste from, the, from, from her. her so. so this is... Uh, we'll do the base base profiles first. So this is two, six, um, nine. Oh, this is scary. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Plus 16. Plus, plus four six. times four. And then plus five. Oh, no, it's plus three. So it's 12. Velocity. Plus 12? Yeah. You totally threw me plus off. Plus one, there. plus oh. I know, so yeah, yeah. You threw me off, though. I don't know where we're at. Shared and velocity so, is 12. So you're getting. Yeah. All right, everyone's getting plus three, and then plus one, so plus four. So this is six. Uh, oh no! Plus eight. Well, this is other, isn't what it? Life total is he at? Oh gosh, twenty-five. Just add up. Just add up. That's what I was base. trying to do. Add up base. That's what I was doing. <laughs> so two uh, plus uh, four is six. Uh, six plus three is nine. Oh no! Plus the equipment is eleven. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. And then 16, 17, 18 from the Lord. Shane's definitely dead. Okay. And you're, then you're Alonso. well over. Oh, and you've gotten the monarch. Didn't respect me. <laughs> oh, and the monarch! Yay! And that then I got to take draw... your monarch and choke on it. <laughs> yes, I got to draw four. So I'm cards. not allowed to talk anymore. Yeah, that's correct. I draw four cards. What happened to Shane? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of crazy. I was just wow. left. Good game. Kind of nice. And then in my second main phase, I'll gain. Uh, I'll gain 24. Ooh, I draw two cards unless I discard a pirate. He, oh, because it's only amount of life lost. You yeah. can't take. I can't get more, more, than, more. Yeah. So twenty-five. You get twenty-five. Twenty-five. 25. Yeah. Not. 25. We don't have to actually calculate the amount of damage he no. really did. It was just how much, whatever. How much life? You can't lose more than zero. I guess it makes sense. I don't know. I don't know. I think it's just down to. I think it's just down to. Yeah. I don't want to count that. So. Uh, I'll discard Dire Fleet Ravager, and. Is this gonna be Adrian's first game of Commander he's ever won? Uh, you know that's not true. Well, Shane, he has 17 life and no untapped creatures. Oh, so you did the folly of Shane. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because yeah, I am. Yeah. But he died for our sins. For... He saved us from you. <laughs> God, there's so many good cards I in this four one. Mana, four mana, four mana, four mana, four mana, four um, mana. I really need to order draw this. off of... Yes, I did draw. Okay. Am I doomed? Did I get any treasure from that? Treasure. I feel like I should get treasure from that. Yarr. You have a bunch of triggers off of that. Uh, oh, wait, shoot. Shane, you already scooped in you. Yeah. So premature. Oh, you can't get his stuff when he's dead anyway. Yeah. Yeah, my stuff leaves the game. No, but this deals damage. Oh, it's all simultaneous. It's well, when I deal damage to him, I exile something and cast it. You yeah, can but exile you it, but then when he loses the game, all his cards just disappear. So if he gets like a But I could resolve something. Yeah. No, no, those triggers go on the stack, okay. and he's already dead. Okay. So cool. he has no hand to look at. Okay, 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 okay. Cool, 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 cool. 
No, yeah, or library. Like yeah, the library is just gone. Yeah. Okay, cool. Sounds good. Um, I'll just summon Admiral back at breast, the original. Ooh. With my you get so two much pirate Beckett lording. Presses? Yay! All right, sorry, I'm done. I'm done. So much pirate lording. And I get to draw a card because I'm monarch. I have two hack bowels. Hack bowel? All right, draw. Mm. Mm, this is gonna be this is gonna be tough. Oh man, I would have stolen stolen one of his things, but he's Bro, dead. They put in a Chroma's will in this deck. Yeah, dude, they're crazy. And I'm gonna play Bloodline Necromancer. So this is a three-two with life link. When it comes into play, I get a vampire or a wizard back. Um, I'm gonna bring back Nighthawk Scavenger. You know Chroma's will? No, these cows. Look at the cat. These cats are oh, huge. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah. They ride them. Did you make a new poll, Mel? Um, was the was the last one Shane? <laughs> I appreciate it. I'm going to use one of my blood tokens. I will discard Etchings of the Chosen, draw a card. Okay, okay. Um, I believe in you, Brandon. I always did. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to attack you <laughs> no. for four in the, in the air. In the air, okay. flying. Ooh. I will take four damage. Okay. Adrian's down to 13. I'm going to gain four, so I'll be back up to 40. I made it back. Oh, what the heck? Am I starting like this? Oh, my God. Um, <laughs> I'll take the monarch. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the king. Dang it. <laughs> I'm the duke. We can actually um, read, acknowledge the monarchies here. <laughs> uh, I'll pay one, make a vampire token, and then at the end of my turn, I'll sacrifice the vampire to populate and make another vampire demon. Beautiful. Uh, I'll draw. Go. I don't want to. You got crazy things going on. Um, You're crazy boy. Uh, what, what is original Admiral Becky Brass? What is she? Uh, it's, she's a pirate lord, and then uh, at the beginning of my end step, I can gain control of a non lane permanent Ooh. controlled by a player who took damage from three or more pirates this turn. And she's a 3 3? 3 3. three, three. Uh, she's a 4 4 because of this lord. Ooh. Oh! Ooh! Ooh. <laughs> you know that Sanguine Bond? What about. Oh. <laughs> sanguine. Call me Bond. Sanguine Bond. <laughs> I don't think it's even Sanguine Bond. Is that the other Exquisite one? Exquisite Blood. Sanguine yeah. Bond is the combo card. Yeah. One. I yeah. wonder if it's in that deck. This, this, these had, had, had crazy cards in here. I don't so think funny. they like putting those kind of like Infinite. two card infinites in these. We don't know, man. Wizards could be that's, upset. That's true. They'd be like, ah. At this rate, I wouldn't, I'd be, yeah. nothing super shocks me. Or I don't think that deck has shock. Shock lands. Ah, yeah, yeah shock lands. That's like the only thing they don't put in pre-cons. They'll just be like, yeah, you get the worst lands ever, man. The man, man Lonely Sandbar. Bad. These are pretty good, though, I have to say. Lonely <laughs> Sandbar. Yeah. It's, I think if you look back at the original commander deck mana bases, it's, you know, like 10 forests, 10 yeah. swamps, 10 plains, and then yeah. maybe like two utility lands. Yeah. yeah. We've I mean, come a long way. There just weren't that many that utility true. lands back yeah. then. That's true also. Every step, they've always come up with new ways to make utility lands. Yeah. Uh, so I'm casting Evolution Sage. That's this, not a Merfolk. This might be the only non-Merfolk creature in the deck. Uh, it has landfall whenever land enters the battlefield. Proliferate. Ooh. Okay. Mm. Proliferate. Whenever a land. Yeah. Under your control. Under, under your my control. control. Oh, okay. Yeah. Whenever I play land. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, it's not that crazy. Um, but Madness. it will be crazy. Yep. Let's go to discover. The craziness will continue. Yeah. Use problem. Uh, we'll pay four. For Tributary Instructor, you guys saw this one. It's mm -hmm. a Mentor 4-4. Four, four. Whenever a creature I control with a 1-1 counter on it dies, draw a card. I get a Merfokium Leviosa. Uh, and then I will pay 3. We're just vomiting our hand out because that's the stage of the game we're in. Yeah. Um, it's Battleship um, now. Oh. Good news for you has good news. Stage of Fables. Good news? Uh -huh. What is the good news? What's the we good, don't know yet. good news? Also, everybody. welcome uh, Lindsay to the chat. What's up? Oh, Lindsay's here. Hey, hey. Hi, Lindsay. I sure hope this is. Is Lindsay going to start playing Commander? <laughs> What's that? Is Lindsay going to start playing Commander? And she's corrupting everyone to play Pokemon. That's her thing. Mel and, Mel and Lindsay were playing some Pokemon. I don't last like night. challengers. <laughs> <laughs> Something may happen. Although, we do have an episode with Lindsay on Magic Titans. We Check do. It it's, yeah. it's really fun. Yeah. I have a bunch of explore triggers. Wait, what the heck? When did this happen? I just played a bunch of Merfolk. Oh, oh more, more Merfolk. We talked about this. Yeah, mm. we did. Uh, I will go right to left this time. We'll start with evolution. Change it up. I like, I like this up. change up. Growth oh. spiral. Don't really want it. Yeah. So we're going to bin that one. Bin it. Uh, tributary instructor. Ripples. Of potential. Oh, it's oh, only this Merfolk. is really good. Sorry, that one's there. Ripples 
of okay. potential. Proliferate, then choose any number of permanents you control that had a counter on them. They phase out. Well, this would be the anti -rap. The next one first. First you explore. This one goes here, yeah. You grow spiral, and then now it's here. Yeah. 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 Uh, so that'll be two counters. <laughs> don't want that. I guess you. Shane wants it. I don't want it. Uh, <gasps> wave goodbye. Oh, that can that can. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, we're gonna leave that. All right, we'll just, that makes it easy. Put the counters everywhere else. Mm-hmm. Yep. Boop. Is that one a one-sided or is that? Everyone? It's a one. It's Boop. return Creatures that don't have counters on them go back to their hand. So your finality guys. No, stay. one one counters. Oh, it's is specific that yes. plus one plus uh, one. Okay. Uh, and finality is. Yeah, better. Yeah, yeah, I, I should this. take a look at this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a new <laughs> blue one-sided like board wipe. Yeah. Goes great with raise the palisades. That was the one wow. I kept thinking was oh, in this deck. Wait, hold on. Yeah. I was just looking at the art and I was like, that's a lot of, that's a lot of unhappy gators. But <laughs> yeah. It's like, are they gators or are they... Uh... Those are like uh, octopodes. Yeah. Octopodes. Oh, they're like, no, I think it's... No, it's, it's like the tail. It's like the little tail frills. That's cute. Yeah. Like yeah. It. Oh, they are gators. Cool, so you have a turn to <laughs> stop Bridget from doing a one-sided board wipe. Um, we will commence the attackening. What's my <laughs> life total? I'm at 28? Adrian's at 13 and... Brandon has a lot. Um, Is the enemy of your enemy your friend? Do you want the stream to end right now? Hot balls of 7-7. Seven, seven. Oh, I was talking about Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Brandon's the monarch. But he also has a death... How did Vampire Nighthawk get back? This uh, this is a reanimate for vampires or wizards. So good. Vampire wizards? Or wizards. Vampires or wizards. That's fun. Oh. Also, uh, what, what, what card types do we have in Graveyards? I'm, I'm uh, card types. Like all of them? Okay, instant uh, land, sorcery, creature. Yeah. I have artifact. artifact. Do you have enchantment? I do. Okay. But no planeswalker. All right, we got okay, six. Oh, there's no planeswalkers in these decks. Oh, that uh, is strange. You know what, Adrian? Someone, someone, someone slipped me a planeswalker. Yeah. The death yeah. touch really scared me no, off. No, I don't so want to die. we will. <laughs> you're not dead. Okay. I'm attacking you with a 7 7 and a 5 5. That kills him. He, oh, has, leave a, he has a blocker, bro. Where? Dude. Oh. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't talk. <laughs> um, I will miss the trigger, so I'll draw. Gotcha. I will not put a land into play. And oh, okay. So what are they again? A 7-7 seven, seven uh -huh. and a 5-5 five, five hexproof. Uh, no trample? No. We don't do that around these parts. Okay. I'll block your 7. Even. And I'll okay. take 5. So you'll take 5. Take 5. Feeling, I want to take five. feeling alive. Cool. I'll gain 5. Oh, my God. I love and this card is great. It's so good. I will play an Islandio, proliferate. Uh, boop. Working down the working down the chain. Boop. Right. Whoop, whoop, whoop. My God. Pass. Okay. Ching, 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 ching. Ching, ching, ching. I think I've got this one. I believe in you. I think I think I can do it. I can do it. The merfolk are the good guys in the story. They're really helpful. Not the vampires that sacrifice. No, the each vampires other. are objectively and make the, demons. They're the bad yeah. guys. Port of Carfell. Uh, that is being a little unfair to demons. It's a land that can pay five, tap it, sacrifice it, uh, mill four cards, and then return a creature card from a graveyard to the <clears throat> battlefield tapped. Okay, that's okay. cool. I actually, I like that land a lot. Um, yeah. What are you thinking? How do you feel? Oh, I could take an extra turn. That's pretty good. You could. That's pretty good. Most excellent. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. um, is there anything weird we can do? We could bring in the saboteur, make them unblockable. What does that give us? Not enough. Uh huh. He's got a whole toolbox in his graveyard. Mm hmm. I think Adrian needs some time. We should. Um, yeah. You know, we should. We should talk about how your playmat's not very. Um, it's not very thematic, man. It's got a ziggurat. Yeah, but his ancestral recalls like not dinosaurs. He's remembering his dinosaurs. You can remember ancestors. that he's like related to the dinosaurs. <laughs> That's why he's like, oh no! <laughs> oh, oh. He's I'm a, a dinosaur. <laughs> yeah. Common. Uh, My great grandfather was a dinosaur. Common, common bird. Common bird things. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> It's uh, like the, the pigeon you see on the street. It's like, ah. Oh. <laughs> I like all these people <laughs> down here. If you look at the mat, stuff. they're like being really judgmental. They're like, ah, oh, he thinks he's so cool well, with his new he's, fancy hat. He's not working. 
Yeah. They're like, bro, get back to work. <laughs> Stop having a headache. Thinking. Mm. We thinking will, is his job. We'll go to combat. All right. Yeah. Um, I will have Brass bring in the Dire Fleet Ravager. Yeah. When it enters the battlefield, each player loses a third of their life. Round it up. We're, just, we're, we're working okay, on Brandon. Okay. That's right, what right. it is. Does so, it have, like, time for math. <laughs> have fun, math. This is going to be 26. Oh, wait. No, no, no. So You lose, lose a third. third. So you lose so, 15. But he will also gain life. So, no, this is lose. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, that is loss of yeah. life? Yeah. Okay. So no, no, when an opponent. So what happens is... Yeah, yeah. But you will lose First, life. you'll lose 15. Okay, so I'll lose 15. Okay. I will uh, I will lose... Maybe, it, maybe this doesn't hurt. <laughs> uh, 10. Because it's rounded up. So I'll go to 18. No, Adrian, you just divided by zero. I'll lose two. Isn't it only opponents? Each player. Okay, cool. So then Nobody you gained 12 because we lost yeah. two. So Brandon regains 12. All right, so we did three damage two. to Brandon. You're, I know your goal was to have him lose a lot of life. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I forgot. It did not work. <laughs> um, we have a finality canter. Uh, could I get one of those yellow dice? Yep. Cons there, thank you. That's that. Uh -huh. I'm not actually attacking anyone because... Scared. I'm scared. You're scared. Uh, I'll fair. pay four to put uh, activate the extra turn. This goes on the bottom of my library. But it actually exiles because it had a finality counter. Uh, sure, yeah. yeah. Left the battlefield. Mm -hmm. Finality. Is that what a finality final. is? Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's not when it dies. The battlefield okay. For any reason. Um, and then we'll tap to go to the bathroom. It's not five. Back. Unless Bridger has something. What? Are, what? It's time to evacuate the board. Oh. <laughs> Return all creatures to their owner's hands. Oh, I love that. Yeah. Yes. The siren. The, now, 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 the siren will go. <laughs> That's great. You like that? He's just gonna replay them. And I get, am the best get, at replay. He's just gonna replay them and get more. Get more. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna fall asleep at the in table. Fact, in <laughs> fact, I paid eight for this guy. Now I can play. Four. What's everyone up Perfect. to? <laughs> What's up, Shane? Yeah. Uh, then we'll go to my next turn. Yes. Oh, and you can replay them all. Exactly. One, turn number two, three, four, and with no five, finality six, counter. Seven, eight. Or wait, no, those guys are gone. Yeah, the finality one's got exiled. Uh, yes. Oh, poop, I forgot that already. Um, so Dire Fleet goes... Wait, where did I put them? Oh, no, they went to the... They, but they the left the battlefield, so they're exiled. So it is. So, uh, Di Pietro and the Ravager. And Zar Zara? Zara's, Zara's been gone, gone, gone for a while. She's been okay. gone. All right, so these are exiled. She's my favorite, though. Since you've been she's, gone. she's up here in my head. Okay, so I don't have to discard. Perfect. That was, that was my plan. That solved that problem. Yeah. We're going to untap everything. <laughs> Solving problem. <laughs> We're going to draw problems. a card. Uh, we'll play a... Oh, <gasps> don't look at that. Play a spamp. God, Brain has 42 life. Yeah, it's a problem. There's so much. It's a problem. If only had Beckett, he could have stole that. Then you could be the person with 42 life. I know, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Do you got this? I've got plans on plans. It's going to take a while, though. Yeah. Take a long so time. Keep... By that he means two turns. Yeah. One to put fifty more folk on the field, and yeah. one to actually just send them at us. Yeah. Uh, I all right. would like haste, please. Say two, three, four, five. Uh, I don't know. I've never moderated Twitch. There's supposed to be a bunch of keybinds and stuff. That I don't know, so don't look at me like that. I don't know them. Uh, I'll play Admiral Brass without the tax. Hey. Ooh. So that's cute. Yar. And we'll play Boop. Boop, boop. Boop. Uh, Corsair Captain, a pi uh, Pirate Lord, and get a treasure token. Treasure. Treasure. Perfect. Trajan. And then my very sloppy tapping. One, two, three available. Four for the treasure. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah. We'll do one, two... Ooh, do I want to... Put an anchor on? It's going to be sorcery speed, so I won't be able to attack with it this turn. If oh, like we it. need to mill when she came in. One, two, Ooh. three, There's some. I see four. some good pirates There's in some there. good stuff in there. I'm into I it. See some, I see some good pirates. Right? Yeah. Uh, now we'll pay four. We'll summon the Grim Captain's Locker. Yar. I can tap it to survey. Um, more importantly, I can tap it until I return all my creatures in my graveyard and get escape. Oh. Pay oh. four to tap them in, bring them in. Um, we'll surveil. Oh, you can do that multiple times? Yes. That's insane. So you do it once just to activate and then you can keep going. We're going to surveil because it's fun. Uh, okay. I like it. Sorry. And it's put it back or put <laughs> it in the graveyard. Yep. 
Yeah. You like that card, Brandon? I'm sorry. <laughs> no, you're my good, bad, you're my good. bad. Oh, I was like, is it a good card? card? The whole game. It is a good like, card. Ooh, what's going on over here? We'll go to combat. There they go. We'll get a big dinosaur from here to here. <laughs> Uh, yeah, what what uh, big what pirate? There's not a single oh, that's thought. Cute. It's not coming to me, is it? Remember, Brandon, that's forty two life. It's the meaning of life. Oh, it is. Yeah. 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 Ah. I agree. Okay. Yeah. You're looking like the monarch over there, right? <laughs> I mean, he, he is a monarch. Uh, we'll do Malcolm the Keen-eyed Navigator. He's a bird pirate, siren pirate, <laughs> two two flying. How do you feel about flying pirates? Like di you said, dinosaurs no, I can't like fly. It. Okay, okay. Because pirates, they got ropes. They okay. like swing around on ropes. That's basically uh, flying. That is true. <laughs> totally That's the closest. Yeah, that is true. Um, the ropes are always going off I need screen, so you don't know what they're thing. actually connected to. I think I got to just sit and try you not to die. You don't want to be the monarch. Monarch's cool, but like living is cool too. That's true. I have six health. Things yeah. things can happen with yeah. very yeah. quickly. All right. Yeah, yeah, for One sure. One tap. For sure. Draw. <sighs> Ooh. They're like, oh, they're okay, straight okay, up put okay, Sink cool, and Bond cool. in here. Um. <laughs> God, we have just gone through so many, like, Everyone's turmoils. popped off, yeah. No, it's been cool, it's cool. So I'll it's play been my cool. really fun deck. I'll play my decks. unclaimed territory. I'll, I'll name Vampire. Mm -hmm. uh, it's the land that Bridger had earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll replay Yehani. Yep. Uh, He's back. Yeah. I it's a really cool play. pirate thief deck, but the problem with it is that everyone else is Hawk's type scavenger. of decks. Yeah. Uh, oh, that, that's uh, Nighthawk back again. Mm -hmm. Back, Mel. Back on the carousel. Yeah. So many things to do. Uh, uh, uh. See, now I can't make any more vampire demons. They're, they're just going to be regular vampires. Wow. That's pretty lame. I, I, I think so. <laughs> I really think so. Um, See, it's a good thing that you held the creatures back because it is. There's, actually. Haste. there's, some, haste. there's <laughs> yeah. some haste going on here. For sure. Um, I will say, I'll say go. I don't have a token to proliferate, and I'll just draw. It's my turn. Yep. You made it. You've made it all the yes. way back, and he's gonna. He's gonna make the most grow, of grow, it. Grow. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, relicor tower. Love it. That was fun. Okay, uh, what lands are important to me? What lands are special? Mm. None of them. Uh, we'll pay four. Nothing sacred. Four mm. Huckball of Surging Soul. Ritual. Merfolk. Nice, uh, nice. Boop, 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 boop. Sage of Fables. Merfolk. You know what that means. Merfolk. Um, How much enchantment removal here? No. None in your colors. <laughs> no. We don't do that around these parts. Um, I like it. Me, 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 me. Uh, we didn't talk about Sage of Fables. This is the first time I've... No, I cast it, but we didn't talk about it. Uh, it's a 2-2 two, two Merfolk Wizard. Each other wizard I control enters the battlefield with an additional 1-1 counter on it. I can pay 2 to remove a 1-1 counter from a creature I control to draw a card. Oh, there it is. Uh -huh. this, Turn counters in the cards? Uh, this not. is relevant because Coppola, Warden of the Waves, <gasps> is a wizard. Oh, look at you this one. Yeah, Coppola, Wizard of the Waves. Girls. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's take a look at this little He card. makes my merfolk cost two more to target, both with spells and abilities. Okay, okay. Uh, it's ward before ward. Okay. Well, I guess it's not technically ward. You could stack. Because this just costs two more to do it. Mm -hmm. Ward is a trigger that then makes you pay two or counter. I see. Technically mm. different. Weird. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Like, if you forget they have ward. <laughs> Or you want to put your card in your grave. Or it's uncounterable. Yeah. Ooh, right. You can't not uh, choose to pay the cost of a spell. You can choose to not pay Warden. If it's uncounterable, then it doesn't get countered. That's cool. Oh, that's fun tech. We're playing the Explorer game again. Let's go. Let's see all what right, we got. All right. uh, Let's ball. go. Curse of the Swine. Oh, that's oh, good. Man. First I'll put the counters out, and then I'll think about it. Exile yeah, tar X target creatures for each creature exile this way. It's controller creates it's a 2 pongify. green but boar. Turns them into piggies. It is big pongify. Yep. Pigify. Pigify. It's pig. Ah, it's great. Um, it's I don't great. really know if I even want this. What? I mean, you know, I have a board wipe in my hand. Do I? And it's a one-sided board wipe. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. we'll just go ahead and bin that. Bin uh, we'll go to this merfolk. Crazy. Tatiova Benthic Druid. Oh my oh, god. Oh, that's that's pretty. Crazy. This deck is all bangers. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, that's that's a lot of cards. Uh, we want to see that one. 
Uh, yeah, She's let's classy. take a look at Tatiova. Unfortunately, yeah. I have no lands at this stage of the game. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you want She's her a, early. Well, you you know you just well. keep exploring. Like you're you're exploring. That's true. Yeah. yeah. She's between me and the lands though. I will leave her. I have mentioned okay. so many they, sub I know they reprinted Tritus, the partner commander. Uh huh. Uh, he's like this. Oh, really good Simic partner yeah. commander. Th yeah. Triton hero. That one. Yeah. Yeah. He's huh. probably. I know he's a, got a reprint. Oop. I think he's a special guest. I have All right. no idea. That's my turn. Oh my G. That was a good one. I'm looking Back. for How much mana do you have? Uh, two. Okay. I have two, two manias. But do you have the city's blessing? Um, I would if I had an ascend creature. Yeah, you need to ascend. Many times. I, yep, I have way more than ten permanents. We'll get, we'll get a second. <laughs> oh, there's a lot blessing. of text on that card. I can we'll, tell. we'll put a second one on. <laughs> and I already like because I surveilled. I knew what it is. <laughs> You're like, huh, this might be good. <laughs> a lot of words, it has to be. I feel like I've seen this before. Oh, gosh, I'm hmm. going to deal with you two. I feel like I die on a whim. <laughs> kind of, yeah. Yeah, a little bit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Take someone with you. I don't know if I can. Make it a glorious ride. I'm playing with the big boys now. I can bring, I can bring in a good amount of creatures. So, like, we can uh, Gaia Reach. Uh, sanitarium. So it would be. So let's see. This this could be a creature. One, two. Well, so escape three. Yeah. Uh, what is the? Because escape has two costs. It has a number of other cards in the graveyard that you exile. Yeah, four. And has a so mana four. cost. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So you pay four. So you just and pay the normal mana cost. No. no. So it's three and a black. Okay. Three and a black. Three and a black. And, and, exile. and escape four. Yes. Yep. Okay. Okay. So it's yeah. four on both. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. 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 But they don't get in haste or anything. Doesn't give them that. No. Yeah, so those great ETBs. But on Arena, you do get to hear cool chain breaking sound. Tish, 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 oh. tish. And then they turn cool. that off. Uro, Uro, the... Uro flashbacks. Yeah. And Croxa. Oh, I remember Croxa. I was a fan of Croxa. I don't know, folks. I don't know what I can do here. I just put up a wall, right? Oh, sorry. You know I have a board wipe. Don't put up a wall. Yeah. <laughs> that was bad advice. Yeah. I'm giving you bad advice. You are. You are. You could do this to survive if I didn't have this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, uh, exactly. That's a shame. Kill Brandon, mm. and then Bridget just kills you. I don't think I can kill Brandon. Brandon's hard to kill right now. Uh, in general. I would just say in general. 42 life. Not even in the game. Oh my gosh. He lifts. Okay, we're going to go to combat. I had a protein shake this morning. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go to combat. I'll play Spectral Sailor, um, which has pay, uh, pay four, draw a card. So we'll draw one. Two cards. Ooh. Let's see what we got then. Actually, I'll do one at a time. So I'll pay okay. four. Whew. How's the first one? Do you think you're going to go for it's a second a reader. one? So it's, it's got to be a good... It's a reader. Can I see your graveyard? <laughs> <laughs> Can I say no? <laughs> I have this... Okay. Okay. Could be anything. We're going to find out. Yeah. I mean, uh, there's a lot of cards in there. Some of them are good. Two, three, four, five. Let's see. Tap four. Tap four. Can I see your graveyard? <laughs> it's, my graveyard is actually very small. What is happening right now? Is it? That's all of it. Okay. Yeah, he's killing his own stuff. Okay. Thank you. At least you can't ripples of potential. <sighs> all my tokens have died, and they just oh, ripple they didn't of stick potential around to be in the graveyard. Right. For him? Huh? Is it only plus one? Plus it's one cameras? still only a defensive spell. <laughs> Okay, uh, we will pay two. Yeah. Just uh, cast Diary Fleet Daredevil. Oh, I love okay. him. This is fantastic. Oh, no. So when this comes into play, I can take a instant or sorcery from someone's graveyard and cast it. Is it Curse of the Swine? Um, I haven't decided. <laughs> I don't know that Curse of the Swine is quite expensive. It's two, yeah. it's blue, blue, X, but you can pay with any colors, I think. Yes. Dare, Diary Fleet Daredevil. Um, I, due to Coppola. Yeah. I am virtually invincible. Right, so we're going to do dam instead. And we're going to kill everything. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what we're going to do? We're going to do dam. Okay. Unless anyone wants to suggest something better. <laughs> <laughs> How many times can you build up your board? I'm going to dam. So I'm going to steal uh, Brandon's card, cast it again to destroy everything. <laughs> Finality, people go away. Brass costs <laughs> about a million mana now. How's chat doing? <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna sacrifice Nighthawk to keep Yeheni, uh, Yeheni on the board. How many creatures? How many creatures did oh, we have die? Uh, uh, do you have another thing to sack? 
Yeah, I have this. Right, so you sack that. Okay, do you so have another thing to sack? Not, a, uh, not currently. But you have a way to make a vampire? Yes. Okay, it happens. Okay. Yeah, five, five of my creatures died. How many do you have? Uh, three, I had six. Okay. So we got 11, Yehenny's, Yehenny's 11. Oh, Can I just come back? Okay. <laughs> Over to you. <laughs> Sorry, Shane. You've sealed I'm gonna start building back up. Dreams. I know, I want Brandon to win. Oh. This is called king making. Wow, mm -hmm. we didn't even have an alliance. I know, see? Wow. The alliance was in our heart the whole time. <laughs> the real alliance was in our hearts. <laughs> I can't have the crown. Where's your wand? What? You're making a vampire? Oh, oh it's already in the struggle. Never mind. Go ahead. Yep. Mm -hmm. yep. Yep. Boom, boom, boom. There was no, no window. There was no time for me to... Oh, is he invincible or can't be regenerated? It's indestructible. indestructible. Right. Indestructiblement. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm. Yep. Mm. So... I'm right. sorry, well, I'm sorry. But he, well, okay. I wanted to make Ooh. a big play. Kill me. What are you... What are you Kill at? both of us. More than 12? Mel, can we see life totals? Am I at more than... Yeah. I'm at more than 12? 18. 18. 18. Oh, that's more than... That's more. You do what you gotta do. Classically more than just looking, looking at what I can do Send here. me to hell. <laughs> to David Very. Jones' locker. Yeah. Which I, I have. I mean, you can bring all these... Oh, I'm, I'm serious. You, I think I do have to kill you because you can bring all these pirates yeah. back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, honestly, play for the win. I think okay, I right. cool. I'll, well, I'll send, yeah. I'll send you honey at you then. Cool. All right. I will die. All right, I will gain yeah. five, five. Join me. It was a good way to die. Six, six, six I'll gain six. So who says you can go to England? Um... <laughs> <laughs> now these conversations are going. Yeah, anyways, so... <laughs> what am I supposed to do? <laughs> Just wait for you to get back? <laughs> we'll Come play Bloodline Necromancer. We'll bring back the scavenger. That uh, scavenger has come back so many times and just stops, right? Play Orzhov Basilica. We'll bounce the land back to my hand. Is he just going to wave goodbye and then This is an pray? uphill, uphill battle. No, Yehenny has one more counter. Mm. Sticking around. Big deal. Uh, I'll end my turn and draw for the monarch. Richard's never beaten. Go ahead. Only... He can only be reduced to a single cell and he'll still regenerate. Only <laughs> tired. Now that's Brandon right now. Yeah. I believe you. I can be reduced to a mere 10 life out of 4 yeah. you and then so come all the way yeah. back. Right? Most of it's self-inflicted too. <laughs> Just like... I took, so some, I took some large creature hits. There were some, there were some large creatures yeah. which... That's which true, which made true. their way across. I was punching. Never count them out. <laughs> I need double blue. It's very like, it's very proper for these vampires. A lot of like self-flagellation going on for sure. <laughs> well, I've been reading the short stories. Yeah, <laughs> the official ones. <laughs> <laughs> the official. Not what, of what about own. the unofficial? <laughs> my, my, Wait, we're not going to talk uh, about the other ones. Yeah, my vampire, excellent vampires, uh, fan fiction. All right, we will we will wave goodbye. So we they're very close though. They're actually, very to be. Similar. Everything without a one-one counter in hand. Uh, I'm going to sacrifice this. To uh, Yanni. To make it indestructible. Yeah. Rude. So this is wave goodbye, folks. And then the other two will head to my hand. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Alright. And that passed. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Shane. We will not. Uh this costs one million mana now. Yeah. Costs uh, ten <laughs> for a hawk ball. That's too many. What's chat doing? I'm good. <laughs> yeah. What's going on there, Jared? What? What's going on, chat? Um, Bug says that Brandon's not really a guest anymore, so he can win. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we see him too many times. That also means I can die first, the time after this. Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah Lindsay, uh, basically Brandon played a spell that said anytime one of us loses life, he gains that much life. Uh, and I decided to keep all my doors unlocked. <laughs> uh, I cast Tessiova, the Benthic Druid. Ooh. Uh, and I... Pass. You have three well, how do you make vampires? What is what <laughs> is the process start? by which? So I have to tap this, pay one, and I make a vampire. Yeah. Okay. So I will. I this will do that never, right now. Never gonna happen. I will make. I will make a vampire. These merfolk are gonna block my one one merfolk are gonna block you, Henny, forever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, no. But it'll be just there being a threat. And how the scavenger is gonna be back. Oh, I always know always gotta have a it's creature. It's in his hand. Of course, it's gonna be back. <laughs> Lindsay should play pirates. Lindsay should play pirates. We're tr it's we're trying to get Lindsay into magic though. Like the thing with commander is like you oh, can land. really overwhelm someone with all options. Yeah. We did we did make her play Doctor Who. That was <laughs> she wanted made she wanted to. Uh, she came over to play Pokemon cards. She and yeah. We're like hey after this we're playing okay. commander right? She agreed to it. <laughs> oh you wanted to have fun? <laughs> <laughs> she allowed that to Weird. happen. Weird. Yeah. God, pitless plunder. 
It's in Mel's new deck. He's so good. He uh, needs I'll to be in like Kindred Boon. So when this comes into play, I choose a creature type. Merfolk? <laughs> um, I'm not going to choose Merfolk. Um, I'm going to choose Vampires, assuming it comes into play. Uh -huh. And then uh, I can pay two to put a Divinity counter on a creature I control with the chosen type. Mm -hmm. And uh, each creature I control with a Divinity counter is indestructible. Are you going to make your Vampire become God? <laughs> Potentially, potentially. <laughs> this is a problem. This is a um, big problem. We need to start writing down just things that conversations that happen in matches. <laughs> yeah. It's like when you're playing your. Phone, I will like, try and put a divinity counter on it. Uh, sure. Okay. All yep. right. All right. That's a good. Uh -huh. That's a good start. Not much uh, I can do about that. Uh, Henny will come in. Yeah, I block with my merfolk. Okay. That'll that'll be my fine. merfolk dies. Holy moly. Uh, he's like. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Foiled one, two, three, again. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, I'll draw for Monarch and, and then, then discard. discard. Yeah. <laughs> That's nice. One. Oh man. Come on, Brandon. I love this underdog story. How much life is Bridger at? Two. Not a lot. 18. A medium amount. Two, three, four, five, this six, might be a long okay. game. Yeah. Got it. All right. <laughs> Here we go. I think we're out of board. I usually put one board wipe per deck. Uh, there was a lot. There was at least two to three. Oh. I mean, Bridger has oh. Wave Away. He has yep. the Pig Curse. He has yep. uh, Aetherize. So, I mean, oh, some of them are more right conditional. Right than, <laughs> but but he's got, there, there are more than one board wipe. There's a healthy amount. Yeah. This deck has two or three. It's good. Uh... We'll start with an explorer. Uh, so I'll okay. pay two. Uh, I may play an additional land this turn, and I draw a card. Nice. Nice. We take yeah. those. Is it nice? It is, yeah, it is a land. Oh. Have a and squirrel. land's turned into more. So I forced more I'll things. gain a life and draw a card. Oh. <gasps> <Yes>. <sighs> oh. Like for real, though. Yes. <laughs> no. Okay, okay. No. I'm backing Brandon on All this. right. We'll cast Deep Root Elite. I'm backing Bridger. <laughs> it is a 1-1 one, one Merfolk. <laughs> Whenever another side. Merfolk yeah. enters the battlefield under my control, put a 1-1 one, one counter on target Merfolk I control. Oh, Ooh. no. So my actually Merfolk is two. Make my Merfolk even more merfolk -y. Wow, that's very synergistic. They're this like, deck has so much synergy. They're folk heroes. Mm. Uh, this they're, is a great time to get into magic. If you're <laughs> looking for a commander deck, any one of these has been fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. Mine was probably the best. It was too good. I flew too close to the side. You did. On the back of a dinosaur. That's what that deck does. Yeah. It goes big, knocks someone out, and then, like, you emptied Isengard, and then all the Ents showed up, you know? Yeah. What are you going to do? Uh, Evolution Sage. Pirate Ents. Just no, an Summon more dinosaurs. <laughs> Tributary Instructor. Ents versus dinosaurs would be sick. That'd <laughs> be sick. Tool decks at Ents versus Dinosaurs. Yeah. Yes, we need it. We should do that. Yeah, we'll get we get A one on. See, then we can get like the the <laughs> complete joke art of like a, a dinosaur with like a chainsaw. Yeah. Like yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> my buddy runs an all tree folk deck. It's great. It's good. It was terrible till like the Lord of the Rings stuff came out, and it was like, oh. Okay, now now there's enough truth. Yeah, it's like yeah, now yeah. it does stuff. You have more than four. Now it's like I mean, before thing. it was, I mean, just kind of Lorwyn, and then there were you yeah. know kind of random tree folk sprinkled around, yeah. right? Tree yeah. folk things you didn't realize were tree folk. Yeah, yeah. we had to That's make nice. this tree folk. a nice a nice sprinkling of tree folk. Uh, I'll pay I just one. Made some folk. Oh my god! I'll pay one and I'll oh, make a vampire with life link. You still wave goodbye? No, I cast it. Uh, I just I blacked out for a second. Yeah, <laughs> a couple <laughs> turns during during uh. It needs some shawarma. <laughs> You should Draw. eat. I don't need to I might pass out. <laughs> you are free to do whatever you would like right now, Shane. <laughs> yeah, we do need another 40k crossover. What would what text would they do? Hopefully we can wrap this up. Orcs. Soon. No worries. Orcs. Don't play Blood Artist. Yeah, we need to do Orcs. Uh, okay. <gasps> uh, I'm gonna put. Is the Divinity Counter at Sorcery Speed? No. I can put it on Instant Speed. My God. Uh huh. So I'll put the. I'll try and put the Divinity Counter on the Blood Artist. Divinity, uh, sorry, the Blood Artist, whenever, uh -huh. what is it? So <laughs> this, is, this, is the, this is the like flagship aristocrats yeah. um, creature, enables so many of the, you know, yeah. constructed synergies, but you know, mm -hmm. you want your creatures to die, and as you're doing it, you get life, and your opponents lose life, so. Which in this case, will make him lose life, and make you gain life. So yeah. Again. Yeah. Still not it's a loop, good. but it is. It's not quite a loop. But 
definitely we're getting results. there. Yeah. yeah. I grab a yellow. Absolutely. Yeah. As, as Are there any non-vampires in your deck? I think this is just a dead card. <laughs> <laughs> it resolves. Yeah, that, um, that happens. All right, let's see. What you doing, Adrian? This is a problem. I'm looking at chat. Yeah. Shane, this is, this right. is a problem. My Little Pony card's unfortunately not legal. Uh, not legal, but we allowed them. Plus, uh, it's I'm gonna for play good, good obscure command. I'm gonna destroy all creatures with three or less and four or greater. Oh. So I'm just gonna destroy all creatures. Oh, I'm dead. Oh. Oh, I die. DM, I die. Okay. <gasps> did so, you do it? I think I did. So we'll let's have, walk through that two, interaction. Four, right, six, so, eight. That's well, eight blood artist triggers. So I will. So I lose eight, eight. and you gain, gain sixteen. Yeah. Uh, and then this will get eight counters bigger. <laughs> And then punch him in the face. And then I, I die. Wow! You did it, Brandon! And then, and then you had all come across. Oh! Hey. 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 Nicely done. Nicely Only done. we shake. Only we shake. Hey! 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 How's it going? Hey! Oh. We just pushed the table. That was awesome! Yeah. Woo. This was a so crazy back and forth game. <gasps> Absolutely. Everyone. Things we look for in a good game of Commander. It's not like winning. Winning's nice, but he. Brandon won and I didn't, so we need to talk about how it's not important. Just kidding. Yeah. Um, <laughs> if you win it, your deck's too good. We look for cool moments where you can pop off, do the thing that your deck's doing, interesting, interesting uh, interactions. We had many phases, many like ages of this game as different players came to power and people were cut down and build back up. That was really cool. Yeah, this is you rebuild yeah. basically every, every turn. It was you know turn. Yeah. every turn you force yeah. the table to have something for ten merfolk. Mm -hmm. yeah. That was so scary that we kept like killing you, but without any like. I went, I went down to like three cards in hand, and it was just like, well, I guess I'll just cast my commander. Yeah. And then I'm back to a board. Yeah, it's every wild. time. The I love it. The explore across the entire board is so good. It's mm. very strong. I think getting uh, the enchantment that makes a merfolk every time I cast a merfolk early That's important. was part of the dominance of the board state. Mm -hmm. But yeah. even without it, the deck comes back so fast. Yeah, no, that's true. It, it is nice. There's only a few cards. There's more now than ever uh, th that create uh, merfolk tokens, mm -hmm. and that's something that's always been really high value right. because you want to you want to go wide and then generate all those tokens. So having that was was strong, but there's more of that in this deck than there has ever been before for merfolk. And yeah. merfolk are old enough that they weren't super careful. A lot of them don't trigger on cast. A lot of them trigger on end of the battlefield. Mm -hmm. So if you just get a bunch of merfolk tokens, yep. you're triggering all of your other merfolk to do their yeah. kindred their merfolk stuff. Yeah. And Hawkball is just like, oh, you got Merfolk of any kind? She's cool. such awesome. a good Love commander. It. Yeah, yeah. I'm definitely I'm going to be building a Merfolk deck. I have it all ready to go. Um, with using her as the commander, it's cool. I was going to say, when you first cast Coral Helm, I think when or Coral Helm was originally printed, that was like the third Merfolk Lord ever behind <laughs> right. Lord of Atlantis yeah. and what was the other one? A Pearl Trident? Yeah, uh, it, uh, Lord of Mats of Pearl Trident. I yeah. think so. Yeah. Those are the first two. And then after that, I think there's quite a few more there's Lords. So there's a lot. Yeah, there's yeah. a lot of Lords. So, but it is great that they are like enabling these now. It's yeah. cool, and they have a cool identity beyond, uh, you know, originally it was Island Walk, and then it was like just tap down Merfolk, and now there's so, this this deck and Merfolk in general play with a ton of different different like dynamics and, and mechanics and things like that. So at, cool. at this point, it's just the value archetype. It's like, mm -hmm. you, you're drawing cards, you're yeah. getting counters, you're making tokens, you're making things unblockable. It's it's tempo. It's just yeah. the embodiment of yeah. blue-green tempo, yeah. which I'm here for. I mean, it's cool because it plays into all the other, you know, it's not just Merfolk. You can have access to all the other cool cards mm -hmm. that blue and green give you yeah. access it's to. Simic yeah, it's Simic still being on, on the yeah. theme. Very Simic. I totally. like that they're kind of like building up these tribes for each of the different, like, mm -hmm. color schemes. Yeah. And it just seems like, yeah, this just really emphasizes it. It's cool. So what was everyone's MVP card, do you think? Ooh. I loved Admiral Brass. I was not expecting. We talked before the game about if I was going to do face commander um, or not. I did it for the sake of split simplicity. I don't really know the deck, so best to explore it the way that Wizards is kind of presenting it to us. But she was great. She kept giving me value when I really would have been just completely fizzled out. Um, so that was really cool. That was fun. So for me, it's actually my commander. That's all you could ask for in a commander. Yeah. Giving them haste is super awesome. Right? Especially with so many that, you know, have the when it attacks yeah. or with the you know shared on animosity dealing damage exactly um, yeah that was funny because i got that early on and it's very underwhelming early on yeah but then we had the big turns where shane just died all of a sudden and that was cool to see straight to the battlefield with haste is very strong and i think yeah. they did it because there aren't many expensive pirates yeah i was getting maybe 
four mana on average. Right. You know, which is good. It's good. Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Yeah. Unlike the free seven mana dinosaurs that you're yeah, getting. Oh, to yeah. Nine, nine. Yeah, I was going to say, my MVP card was that Descendant's Path is just yeah. turn over. Oh, here's the comma. Uh, and combined with Discovers, like, I was just getting so many free dinosaurs. Did it's you? weird that this deck has, like, before it was ramp was just, hey, put more lands on the field. This one's just like, get just free cards. <laughs> Right. Yeah, dinosaurs are sort of about random cheating. Yeah. Mm. Like, I was going to say, a real behemoth was also pretty good for you in terms of, you know, it, it rewards you for the ramp that you've already done and yeah. makes all your lands so much better. Yeah. The turn that you had just, you know, nine lands on tap with a real, I was just like, oh man, this is, this is a lot coming into play. <laughs> yeah, I'm so very excited. This is... Yeah. Absolutely. What did you think about your deck, Brandon? Any M MVP that stood out for you? You know, I, I'd have to say... Probably Exquisite Blood, the, yeah. the enchantment that gave me the life, you know, kind of pushed me back out of range. That's not just one attack mm -hmm. that once I start looking dangerous. Um, but Yeheni was, Yeheni was also very yeah, good right. in yeah. terms it's of just, yeah. you know, it's indestructible, it's got haste, it takes mm -hmm. advantage of everything that happens, especially, you know, on a multiplayer table versus just right. you and one opponent. Yeah. So What was the one that kept making the, uh, oh, the, the tokens? That was cool. The, the that was what heart. really helped you into the game. because it's, it's new, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, glass heart. yeah, this one, Glass yeah, Cast Heart. Um, yeah, it was amazing. Made the blood token so I could filter. I actually found the, the dam yeah. off of a blood token. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> so like, we're all joking. We're like, ah, there's, we know there's dam in there. And then I was like, oh, you have it. It's actually in hand um, right now. Yeah. But yeah, made the blood tokens, made the vampires every turn. You know, I think being able to you know make sure you use all of your mana and resources mm -hmm. is really awesome. And just like being able to yeah. turn one life and one mana into a creature. That's great. It's, and um, blood, I think blood is a really cool way to give consistency without just giving card draw. Yeah. Like yeah. black and red needed a way to play the game. Yep. And and I think blood is a great segue into like okay, you can hand sculpt, but you can't just draw a million cards because mm -hmm. yep. that's not in your color pie. So blood, I think, is a is a great way. I think it's to yeah. make the deck consistent. Super underutilized. Yeah, I have a my vampire deck is all about blood tokens. Oh, it is not underutilized, Shane. They print <laughs> so many blood cards. Yeah. Oh, I know. Yeah, they all... spent like a year just printing blood cards. Yeah. <laughs> blood. Cool. All right, guys. Well, it was fun. Um, fantastic. Um, it's been lovely hanging out with Chad. Thank you so much for, for, yeah. for joining us, tuning in, whether you're into magic or just into just hanging out, playing games. We really appreciate it. Love, love seeing all that. Of course, if you haven't already, hit that follow button. Uh, and if you have, uh, if, if you have the, the means uh, to do so, give us a subscribe. And of course, follow us over on YouTube, Magic Titans or Tabletop Titans, whatever your preference is. Uh, we'll be back, of course, uh, here on Twitch doing more hobby content next week. And we'll be playing more games. We've got a bunch of stuff in the queue. Uh, and of course, on uh, for our members, we have a Tuesday game, probably in Pair of Fists versus something. It's gonna be super, super fun. Uh, and honestly, just a big thank you, uh, uh, Shane, Brandon, for driving out, coming out. Yeah. It's been really fun yeah. playing more more games on stream lately with you guys. This has been yeah, awesome. Yep. Thank you. With that, uh, we'll catch you all next time on the tabletop. Bye. Bye.